Riley's You Know What Do podcast on Riotcast.com. Oh, oh, if I suck dick, I would just get a fucking boa and sit here all day and just do podcasting all day. Come on in, guys. Show 11. <laughs> I suck. I overact. I have a quick temper. I am scared of everybody. And I want to fight everything and everybody. But yet, I want to love everybody and have everybody love me. I'm a sick individual. Welcome to the YKWD <laughs> podcast. Six years running on the Riotcast Network. Thank hey. you to laughable.com. Hey. Over 400 something episodes. Uh, laughable.com. If you guys love podcasting, you're going to go get this app right now. It is the uh, premier podcast app. If, uh, say, Andrew Schultz was here today with a yeah. lovely haircut and is on a show with Justin, uh, it will bring up every single show Andrew has been on. That's brilliant. Yeah. Uh, and so you can find Good. other people's shows. So you can, it's, a, it's, a, it's an app that, and, and they manually do this right now for you fucks. You can buy tickets. My show at the, the Laugh Factory in Chicago, which, by the way, I want to thank everybody who works out Yay. there. Wow. Aaron, Brian, I mean, the whole fucking team at Laugh Factory Chicago was brilliant. The comics were great. And the fans sold it the fuck out. Whoa. Um, packed the fuck up. Uh, and it was great. One night, one show. Suck my dick, an hour and ten minutes, standing ovation, boom, I'm out. That's the way you should do comedy. Fuck this six nights. Hey, you want to come in on Wednesday and leave on fucking yeah. Tuesday? Are we talking or are we still quiet right now? We're still quiet. <laughs> no, you can talk. <laughs> I, this uh, month I had three Wednesday through Sundays. It really um, was Look, a I, lot. I, 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 but I, I got to say, do them. Of course. What am I, yeah. No, but do them and hate them <laughs> because when you don't have to do them, when you can finally get, it's, you're going to go, no. And they're going to go, huh? <laughs> There'll be a point where you get to say no and there's nothing. Oh, look, I just did the Hartford Funny Bone Friday, Saturday. Yeah. Suck it. I used to be there Wednesday to Monday. Yeah. Oh, oh, I can't do it. I just can't do it. But this last week, fucking Laugh Factory, incredible. I also did Footprints. Right, Michael? Yep. Footprints to Recovery. Oh, real quick. Laughable sold tickets. So if you, you get your own show, uh-huh. you do your podcast a lot, something, whatever, you can go through Laughable now, sell tickets right off the app. Wow. It's like Spotify for podcasts, basically. It's awesome. No, it's Laughable. I know, but you it's saying it's got the same- app. No, you don't do that. App, listen. <laughs> I'm comparing it to the best fucking music app of all That's time, That's like me Bobby. comparing you to, to, to Andrew. You don't want that. You're different. You're a different sexy. You're right. I'm sorry. See? <laughs> I'm wrong. That's like, you're just like Andrew. You guys are both sexy and have fucking- No, 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 no. I like it the way you said it the other time. What? Like, you're not like Andrew. You're sexy. Like, I like that. Uh, Andrew's but... sexy. He listen, is, but I like the way you said know. it the other time. Uh, first of all, I'm going to talk about both of you fucks. I, I follow you on Instagram. Can okay? I Can I say something about laughable Please? that's good? Yeah. Um, I think one of the hardest things about finding podcasts yeah. is that um, it's not like YouTube where you just stumble upon some shit. Yeah. If I'm watching a video clip about Robert Kelly on YouTube, all yep. of a sudden there's a bunch of other things that suggest you in it. Bing. And I think Laughable suggests the exact same thing. Oh, I really like YKWD. Oh, my God. Justin's on this other podcast with blah, 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 et cetera. So it creates yeah. a more uh, for conducive environment for, for <laughs> discovery. Right. Well, it, well, you're right, because here's what happens. Most people who listen to podcasting, they're doing it because they have they have, a, they have to 40 hours, 60 yep. hours a week job, yeah. and they need something to get them through it. Yeah. Right now, there's people listening to us at a job, at a toll booth, waxing a floor yeah. at from twelve to four in the morning. Yeah. Second job, and, and they, they get pissed if it's not uploaded on time. They do because that job is boring. Well, I'll tell you this: th we're talking to them right now. Hi, oh, are we guys? Live? Hi. Hi. Oh, you guys do live? Don't be dumb. No, I'm saying that. We're, it's, Wait, you do or you don't? We're live, but I'm not. That's not what I'm saying. It's like when oh. you listen to a self help tape, Andrew. I, you feel like the guy's talking to you I'm, when you're oh, listening. Oh, that's what Bobby's saying. I expect more out of you. Well, I uh, thought you guys are actually live. They're Justin, listening right now. You Justin, said they're listening right if now. If you made that mistake, I'd let it slide. I know you would. I expect more out of you. All right, okay. I'll do my best. I thought I, could I don't even laugh expect you to understand metaphor. this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen. I do have a podcast comment, but I'll wait. Why? Well, I don't know. Uh, well, I just want to say. So I went through a breakup, <laughs> and I was so sad. So I just got really into porn. And so I've started following everyone. So I started list, trying to listen to my favorite porn stars on podcasts, and it's a true nightmare. Yeah, I'm so glad you they brought this up now. Nothing to say. I just please can you I give us one like name because I'm going to have them look it up right now. I need to hear this. Give me one of the podcasts. I like Nikki Hearts right now. But no, what's what's in it? I want to hear. I don't know her. which pod. I look up the girl I like, yeah. and then 
I've been listening to the podcast. No, heart's like a regular. I can't believe this is how you decided to spell any of this. Well, it's point can stars, you not, so it can you not <laughs> spell shame people, please? <laughs> yeah. I've just never seen Nikki with an E who, at the who, end. Who it's so it? funny. Somebody else. But anyway, so I tried listening, and they're just, um, they have nothing to say, and it's so sad. Oh, they're vapid holes? That's what you're yeah. so, <laughs> Shocking. I, they're not vapid. <laughs> but the worst is the guys that are interviewing them like to s their own hang, voice, hang, hang so they don't second. even let the girls talk. Their questions are bad. But I just tried to get into it, and I couldn't. We're going to bring one of these up. Hang on one second. got to take this fucking Apple Watch off because it won't stop buzzing. All right, you're popular. You get go. over it. No, these are text messages from her uh -oh. around 10, 24 minutes ago. Uh, okay. This fucking stupid watch. Apple, you failed. Yeah, my beats you stopped failed. working. Send us free ones. You failed. Don't send us anything. I don't want nothing from you, Apple. Send them. If someone tells me what kind of headphones to buy, my beats broke. It's really sad. Oh, I, I really I got cheap ones for Listen, fuck cheap ones. Sorry. I got them for you right now. You want What do you want, over the ear or do you want in the ear? Over, of course. Okay, Sennheiser. Mm -hmm. That's oh, what someone wrote to me on the internet. Great. Okay. The best, great. hands down, yep. headphones. Fuck, beats stink. They're just pink and so Bose cute. Bose fucking horse shit. Blows. That's what they call them in the I, fucking I know. The the audio headphone files. community. I, well, <laughs> well, Bobby knows. We're, I just didn't like the joke. It wasn't a joke. I was saying, but that's the whole thing. Blows. Was, they call it blows. I know. It was a joke. But I'm saying on the forums, which it's I not... know you spend a lot of time in. <laughs> I don't form. do forums. <laughs> Yo, don't you don't do the electronics forums? I also don't want to talk bad about uh, people that, I, uh, that I'm that i liking. I feel scared. No, now. we're not going to talk bad. I just want to listen to it. I, I, it's I, so brutal. Uh, listen, here's the thing. Look <laughs> at me. You just shit on them. That's how you fucked up. I know, but I like them <laughs> so much. Ready? Yeah. PXC's 550s. I believe they are. On, on Sennheiser, they're all tight. Look at this. You do this. You want the volume up? Slide your finger up. Want it down? You, and and this is the best part. So when you're in an airport and people start talking and you got to take them off, these, you just go like this. Touch them. Boom. Speakers on the outside. Wow. So you wow. hear, I can wow. hear you like I don't have them on. But how much are those? Like $7,000. No. I'm kidding. They're only like, they're the same as Bose. So it's like three, 400 or more? 300 bucks, something like I that. I could do, okay. I know a guy who might get you a deal. I would never. Okay. I'd break right? them. I'd, br I'd break them. Yeah, I'd break oh, them. Oh, and another good one. Like $10 week. headphones. Here's another good one. Well, the they're, Bluetooth. Listen, these are Bluetooth. Is that what you're paying for? The Bluetooth? Is this on? Is this working? Bluetooth, <laughs> my show. Listen, I know everybody, this is the problem doing podcast with everybody now Lisa when I'll I, direct all questions to what, Bobby and Bobby will talk to no, you no when I you. used to do podcasts this yeah, is, this yeah. is, this is I, I've noticed this no no it's not that is yeah. that everybody's used to doing their own show yeah. so when people start talking you want to take you want to go so let me ask you about this. and you want to go so Bob so me. no questions we can't ask no, questions no you can do it we can. answer questions I feel like you want. can I ask Lisa a question if I, I don't want? know if you heard the intro no yeah. rules whoa <laughs> no topics sounding kind of ruly today I just want to say I think this podcast is that's how Oh, podcast does <laughs> you motherfucker <laughs> thank you Michael. okay let's listen to this porn star <laughs> wait, wait 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 stop that's not your call <laughs> no <laughs> rules you no, said no rules, rules. I that's, a rule. porn star. that's a new rule right so the now rule. we have a rule the tv is off limits it's getting very fascist listen. bobby <laughs> it's getting very fascist all right tell him what that means fascist listen. means <laughs> not fashion fascist <laughs> yeah yeah with a t at the end yeah, exactly oh. almost like your, oh, I have your drop collar you, all right hang on yeah. this is yeah. a clusterfuck okay. I, i'm getting my niece a dog for a bat mitzvah bobby i'm not talking out of turn right now i think this podcast is going great no this is what you're gonna do i just want justin to tell me the hair remedy treatments i will we're gonna do two things he's got something better than propecia listen no of course he does you told me you have something better than propecia i don't want to talk about it you should also you're not giving away the secrets he's sad he doesn't want people to know i'm not talking out of turn i'm waiting thank you just all know that you use about on my podcast Constantly. Andrew, yeah. Andrew, okay. yeah. I'm gonna make a new rule. Shut the fuck okay, up. Okay, I'm gonna shut the fuck shut up. Shut the fuck up. All right, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, listen. I'm Kay? listening to everything you're saying, Bobby. Nikki Hearts. Yeah. Nikki listen. Hearts. Okay, go. listen. This you can do, you can say whatever you want. Me too. Hashtag. It, it's time. Time's up. What is it? Is it's it time? time? It's time. Time's listen. up, Bobby. Hashtag it's time. Listen. Time's up shut on up. that kind Andrew's of behavior. talking again, oh, Bobby. Sorry. You're like fucking Gino Bascante. Shut the. Oh fuck no, up. it's not that bad. It's not good, Bobby. It was going so good. Exactly. Oh my God. That's right. I love you, Gino. I no, listen. I I she goes. Gino. She goes. Who's that? Who's that? A comic? That's what she's. Well, <laughs> All right. <laughs> Look, Hi, Gino. He stopped talking. Listen, That's how bad you see it was. my posture change? I just got deflated. My head's in my shoulders. All right. Here we go. Let's start this. Um, let's start. First of all, introduce everybody. What if it's not oh, that right. bad? I just. I didn't know. I, this just Michael. A lot, of a lot of pressure. Shut up. A lot of pressure. We got. Uh, 
Andrew Schultz over here, yeah. the brilliant idiot. Yes. Brilliant idiot. Uh, and also a uh, very talented actor. Oh, shit. And okay. comedian. Thank you, you. You just filmed an episode of something, a movie. Uh, yeah, I was filming a, I, I was filming a movie in uh, West Virginia, and then I got to do another movie in uh, Charleston, which was cool. Halloween. I got to do that. A uh, Halloween? They're bringing back Halloween. You're with in Rob, it? Rob yeah. Zombie? Wow. No, it's actually uh, Danny McBride and David Gordon Green are rebooting the franchise. Now, here's the thing about that yeah. is when they do these horror movies, usually yeah. the people, you know, uh, Matthew McConaughey was in Texas Chainsaw Massacre, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Jamie Lee Curtis. There's always some breakout person who's a no name. Right. And then around 10 years later, bang, bing. Yeah, yeah, Jennifer yeah. Aniston, she was in Leprechaun. Was she? Yeah. yeah. Leprechaun wow. 3, maybe. Yeah. Back to the hood. <laughs> Leprechaun 3. Nice. So this, this so could be yeah, it, Honestly, it was or the coolest thing. you yeah. fade off into obscurity. Exactly. Like I could do that. Else. I could do it's that. It's still a it's prize. You're in a, huh. such a franchise. That's and so Jamie cool. Lee Curtis is back in it, which I think is dope. Wow. Oh, she's And they cool. got the original guy who played Mike Myers, Nick Castle's in it. Is she so going to be cool. eating her fucking uh, I Take a Shit yogurt? Wait, what? She has probiotics? Activia. Wait, that's what makes you take a shit? The pro, but yeah, it's the ta it's the smooth move yogurt. I I tried smooth. I went to Israel and I got constipated for a month after going to Israel. Con consummated? Constipated. Oh, go ahead. Bar uh, mitzvah. I tried smooth move. I tried Dolkalax. I did grape nuts. I did literally everything you could possibly do to take a shit. And a month later, yeah. I'm getting back to regular shitting cycle. It's scary because you know Patrice had that one time he shit. He this is a story he told me. One of the grossest things that ever happened. Yeah. He did, he came to New York, and what happens when you get nervous or whatever happens when you travel, you shut down. And he yes. shut down. He went back to Boston. He had to reach inside one? his butthole and pull something and out. pull it out. It was so hard. Oh my! Like God. pinch it and grab it and pull it out. Is that what happens? I'm um, thank you for doing the act out too. This part, yeah. yeah like thank pinch you. it like that, like a little one of those things in, in Denny's. <laughs> yeah. Crane. Anyway, like no, it's toy frightening. Wait, it's the toy crane. I sh yeah. That's okay. I, I, I needed a visual before we moved on. I, actually, I gave you the yeah. visual. <laughs> right, but that I, was just the way the crane goes. That you literally the crane and Denny's. I don't spend time in Denny's. I don't right. know if you've looked. But at this me, is not. The, this I is the reverse you know. crane. This is going oh, up. I don't like that he fucking brought me. Yeah. It's like brought me pastries. More like a, I always do. And it's more like got, a light bulb. Yeah. Really, isn't that what it is? You kind of reach up and then twist down. That's what it would be. You'd be removing well, a light I've bulb. I've never been around two dumber, good-looking guys than you two. Listen, at least we're good-looking. <laughs> you know what I mean? You're we're unconventionally. You unconventionally. I'm unconventionally. You good-looking. Classic. Yeah, you're just <laughs> better-looking than me. Buddy, let me. Uh, you're unconventionally. Let's do a poll on Twitter. See Let's what go happens. Let's go right now. Wait, I know he's a good-looking guy. On, he's a, in better can't. shape. Look at the camera. No, you're yeah. in good, very good. Look at you're the camera. Shape. You're in better shape. Okay, go. Where are we? Put your headphones on so you can hear. That's why you're yapping. Put your headphones on. I don't like the headphones. Doesn't right, matter. Put them on. Oh, God. Put Do them I have on. To? Not with the photo though. Not with the photo. Okay. Take the photo. All right. Without All right. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait. Look oh, at I'm looking at this camera look right here. Gabby. Okay. Listen. Gabby. Right, Gabby. Move this out of the way. Come on. Gabby. Look at Gabby. <laughs> Gabby. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get my. Let me get my. Don't listen, dude. No. Don't be. Be sexy, Justin. I'm I want you to win this. <laughs> Why do you want him I'm to win? Because he's I, trying not to, and it makes me mad. No, no, try, try. to try to be sexy. Justin, you got this. Sexy? I'm, I'm What's sexy? Like, like, leaning you got back it. is more sexy. Look, look, right yeah. there. All right, take the photo. We're just too cool. All right, guys. cool. Do a hey. poll. I want a poll on Twitter right Yay. now. Yay. Okay. I, I know who I pick. Who do you pick? I'm not telling you until the poll comes in. But who do you Wait, pick? We Instagram. already said who you pick. You picked Justin. It's a not story. The people did not you that. said Justin. I said he's good looking. You're unconventionally good looking. What is unconventional? I feel like you're more nice successful than ugly. I am. It's just not mm. a classic look, like Benedict Cumberbatch. Unconventionally good looking. I think looking. he's handsome. That who guy. else? Yeah, but he's a weird looking. Unconventionally. That's not like oh. he doesn't look like the dog Brad Fraser. Not traditional. Brad traditional. Ah, not you've traditional. seen Justin. Put look your headphones before. on. Is, are we listening to something? <laughs> yes, you're listening to me. Apparently, you're not listening. <laughs> I to me. am listening Bobby. to you. I can hear you no perfectly. No one can right here. not hear you. I just want to say yeah, that. Yeah, I can your hear you really well. You're a good talker. Yapping. This is. I hear you worse. Shut up. I hear you worse. All right, you're gonna hear me. Please don't turn it. I want to say this. Handsome. Well behaved. Behaved. Yes, Put him on your Very head. well Who behaved. Who was more handsome if you don't in your on heyday? Your head, I'm going to stop. You are just shutting it down. You are shutting it down. I'm shutting it down. Put this them on your head. Sounds like another rule. That's all I'm trying this to say. This isn't a rule. We, we I didn't have rules. any rules, and now there's lots of rules. Yeah, but in the no this rules, you can make a rule. Start, the rules right. you can make a rule. Okay. okay. Listen, the, the part of the no rules is you can make a rule right now. Bobby Kelly. I'm going to say something right now. Seller picture. Seller picture. Bobby Kelly. The one downstairs. That jawline. That handsome, confident look. Listen, Andrew, yeah. put the fucking headphones on. <laughs> not joking. Fucking put the fucking serious. headphones on. No, I'm not. 
<laughs> it's time to move on. Yeah. Because you're bugging me. Yeah. You're acting like fucking nine year olds. All right. Now let's go. I am. Shut up. You're right. Yeah, because you keep going me. Like throwing <laughs> him out of the bus. Don't yeah. be a pussy. All right. Listen. Next to Andrew, we have Justin Silver. Oh, we haven't even started. <laughs> no. <laughs> you haven't shut the fuck up. Yeah. Out. Yeah. You keep talking. Hi, I everybody. We were the, in it. The theme Sorry. song was playing the this whole really time. Loud. You didn't have the headphones. Really loud. Um, Can we turn that down? What do you got? Thanks. Let's go. Turn that down no, and next to him, we have Lisa Traeger. Hello. Thank you. Yeah. Nice to see you guys. I really Hi, liked Mama. the video of you and your son and your farting. Oh, so New cute. Year's. Yes, that's, that's so great video. video. Oh, bring that up. Let's play I watched it, it a few watch times. Time. So we cute. Watched, now we watched it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's so it was good. a big hit. On I you. like seeing you as a dad. I don't really see that often. I like seeing me as a dad. I love being. I fucking love being a dad. It's so funny too because somebody who was it. Some I forget what it was. Somebody came on who I really like and said kids suck or something like that. And Ari, I was like, no, because he's like always oh, that. No, he's been he's been good around my kid. He's cool. He's not a dick. Did the I person tell have people, a kid that said that? Uh no, and oh, I understand it. Yeah. I I get it, but other people's kids suck. My best, my best Max friends just had a baby this week. It was a week and two days overdue, but yeah. it's three days old and it's so cute. I fucking love my kid. He's he's uh, he's crazy. I love that he's a little fucking nuts. But he's also got a big heart. Like he, I liked it. His little, he's a little out there. He does some crazy shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, but uh, you don't want a boring kid. I do not. I, these kids that sit there like this. We were at a birthday party, and there was just kids sitting at the table, <laughs> and then they would just eat their cake and then get up. Mm. My kid's running around. He went over and hugged the birthday kid, and he's like, "Happy birthday!" Gave him a big hug, and you know, I, I love that shit. I love that he's like. That's that a kid. sweet kid. He's a good he is kid. A sweet kid. Yeah, he's a good kid. Look at him. Aww. Fucking. It's a good head of hair. Good bro. head of hair. First, I knew you, my that's first thought. My guy. First thought. That's my guy. Yeah, talk right over it, you Say fucking yammering assholes. Jesus assholes. Christ. Christ. <laughs> um, you too? No, I. Yeah, I did. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. <laughs> 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 I, 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 <laughs> I right, fucking love stop. him. He's out of his mind. <laughs> oh, Listen, I cute. knew you two. This is what I knew about you two. It's oh, the first cute. thing you're going to say is his hair. Yeah, and he has a great, great compliment. He's got a great Fantastic head of hair. Fantastic head of hair. Because it's great. straight, but got a little, little, little texture wave to it. A little wave. There's a shine. Little, that's a gorgeous head It wasn't head of hair. blonde. It was oh, like a light it, brown. Oh, like a rare color. Traditional beauty. It's like Robert Redford. <laughs> if Rob, that's Robert, like Robert Redford hair. Call. Kids got Robert Redford. Robert Ooh. Redford is for Bobby sure a blonde, me. though. I'm is looking. He? How yeah. would you Beautiful. tell somebody to look at you I just, I when I'm you, literally doing? I this. wanted you to hold the look while I said it. That's, well, just yeah. fucking. It, it don't, needed more. It needed more. I don't like your power move. Look at me. That's my move. I don't do that. Yeah, you did. I don't do that. You said look at me. I'm looking. I'm doing this. I'm giving you love. I'm telling you, sharing something with you, Bob. That's called intimacy. Call Alan. <laughs> I, I just came from. Him. You've literally you both threw a hundred dollars out the window. <laughs> what? I, I just came from my therapist. Oh, you out did? the window. You go to I, that guy too. I think the last thing I said to him. I Everybody think the last thing I said guy. to him was like, "No, it's a good day today. I'm having a great day." <laughs> no, I, I'm kidding. By the way, I love you right. guys. I love um, you. I love you, and I think your kid is fantastic. Head of hair, an adorable it. kid, very Unreal. handsome kid. I, uh, I very just, handsome. I just kid. started therapy this month, I'm, and. Um, yeah, I wish I went sooner. It's who do you, who do you, do you go with to the comedian guy? No, I go to like a witchy woman. Hot. Yeah. Nice. Like Hot. a voodoo. You're such a weird. <laughs> you're such a weird, and I mean this Not in a compliment. Voodoo. You're such you 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 have nothing to do with this comedy community. Like you do things. You're 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 one of us, but you do shit. You just go off on tangents. Yeah, I'm, you see I'm your own therapist. She has a life, is what you're no, saying. No, but I'm saying no, but it's like not her own therapist. Uh, uh, she's witchy. It's like, what? I mean, if uh, it's fucking crazy, like you see a witch. What? She's not a witch, but she, <laughs> you know, I like. There's a bat and a box, and you have to hit, like. I just want, wait, wait, what? 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 She's like a spiritual Stop. crystal type. No, go lady. back, go back. There's like an what? LA type of. Thing. Yeah, there's like, but this. She's a millionaire. She's so good. But there's uh, a bed. There's like a box, like a. a cube. Do you have to get in it? Right. No, but I have to like beat it sometimes with a bat and say things or push it. It would make me so happy she if she was back. into like submission stuff, and there was a, just some old guy yeah. wrapped up in there, and that was his thing. He paid him like a thousand dollars a day to like get... a gimp yeah yeah <laughs> beat on the box i need you to be wait on the is box. she a millionaire from the therapy we... she does or from other reasons yeah things? from therapy yeah wow she, i got recommended from a friend she doesn't see new people but i was lucky enough to get in and oh that's her hustle so we gotta helpful. get in on that's her. like bernie madoff she's so helpful <laughs> how'd you get in wait a minute what do you stop. mean she doesn't take new people. How did you get in? I, I want to ask a you a question. Cool rapper yeah. friend. You just said you just said something very interesting. It's like Bernie Madoff, right? It's, that was saying, his hustle. You're saying this that thing of people can't get in is a hustle. No, exactly. I'm going it in works. at like eight a.m. tomorrow. No, I understand what I'm saying. And look, she could totally be you know legit. All I'm saying is 
once somebody, it's like when you're buying sneakers and you know, can I have this in a 12? And the guy goes, I think we're at a 12, but I'll check. You already bought the sneakers. Oh, bait and switch. Exactly. You already bought no, them. I'm already thing. buying the sneakers. This girl makes your hair grow thicker if you see her, though. Did so you know funny. that? What'd you say her bait name was? <laughs> How many times well, do I have to beat the box? Well, my girl won't let, she doesn't want me to tell anyone because she's like, I don't want people to start going to her. We want to keep it. Yeah, my... But you think that's part of the hustle? Hold on, hold Quiet. On. My headphones went out. Did you see that? No, mine are great. Mine are good. working. Yeah. Talk to me about it. Do you think that's but part of the hustle? But she's very talented. Well, I she's mean... like, don't sit. Listen, I don't want you to tell anybody. I think Is she it... a gypsy? No, no, no. She's a gypsy. No. <laughs> she's a gypsy. No, my rapper friend was like, don't be, because she knows I talk too much. So she's like, don't be telling all your friends about her. But she just made some connections. God forbid other people it. get healed. Dude, we're on a podcast now. <laughs> we all, everyone knows about her now. Yeah, but, but she, I don't know. She just so good i don't know i've been i've she's taught me a lot it's like molly she's molly and a human I there's know. a show there's a new show that I'm i just watched there's a new show that i just watched about oh, who the fuck it's about gypsies and about my big fat uh, fabulous wedding that one no it's it's, a sh- it's actually uh, that's greeks it's, no, that's uh, a, gypsy a gypsy show. show about no, that. no, no, I know it's, what movie uh, you're talking about, but no. It's on Netflix, I think it is, or, or on, on, on oh, Amazon. Are Hulu. you talking about Peaky Blinders? No, that's okay. a, that's an old movie. That's, an, that's a <laughs> what movie the about the. What are you talking about? Right. That's England. You need to watch okay. the gypsy wedding okay. shows. It's insane. These gypsy communities in America are nuts. Yeah, and they're close. They're here. They're like in upstate New York. Yeah, cool, right and they're here. like 14 year old girls, and they're encouraged to be I... such sluts on the dance floor. But Shut Eye. Go to Shut Eye. Shut Eye. This really- guy, this right here, this yeah. show. I'm glad he's still working. Well, he's great. I love him. He was in the, a couple shows that I love, but he's On a great USA. actor. You're a USA right. sitcom I was guy. a US guy. <laughs> I, I am. They've, they've changed a little bit because I like that little easy to watch shit. Like good say. head of hair. It's, but, it's receding a little, but good head of hair. This <laughs> Is guy, that all you think about? Oh, that's it. All right, let's I just shave my head. All right, guys, can you settle the an hour fuck ago. down? Why are you what? saying guys? I haven't said a word. He I'm talking incited to him. It. He You're looking at it. me. No, and Justin guys. incited. He looked at me and gave me a look. This is going to be the first 45 minute YKW I've ever done. Wait, you think we're, it's going to go shorter? No, I'm going to end it because you're bugging me. <laughs> I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> Why are you upset? Because it's great content. It's not great content. You keep talking over people. All we're right, trying sorry. to forward the fucking show. Okay. And you keep commenting on people's hair because you're a okay. fucking moron. Yes, I agree. All right? That's why. This guy, what's his name? Donovan. Uh, Jeffrey Donovan. Thank you, Michael, for breaking the tension. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen Bobby. Do so you angry. ever get like that yes, with your have. son? Or really? <laughs> yes, he has. Don't what? fucking kid yourself. At him. Listen. <laughs> Why me? Fucking... Listen. I love you. Listen, I, love I love you too. I love you. I love everybody in this room. Shut the fuck I up. I don't need to be grouped in. Uh, I gave you an individual. I, I gave him. you an individual. I can't stand him. Right, this is listen. this is maddening. I'm One just... of my least favorites. <laughs> 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 oh, listen, not for everyone. There's three people that like you in this room. You're two of them. Oh, listen, I know. <laughs> it's a um, gotta love yourself. Gypsies. Ah, uh, fuck it. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Well, I want to know. No, I don't want to tell you. They're nuts. What? I have to read this now? You said you wanted to oh, do it. I've never been looking forward to fucking reading <laughs> on the show. I want to know about the gypsies. Shut up. <laughs> I love that you are. I love that you are throwing him under the bus. <laughs> but Bob, I'm being good, boy. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. I just re- I thought Justin and I were on the same team. This is my character. This is what I, I do. I don't I like that you're throwing him under the bus. Yeah, I'm not throwing anybody under the bus. I thought we were on the, the, the same team. We're on the same team. All right, good. We're on the same team. Jesus. All right. Um, we'll see who wins that. Can you go to all right? This this you ever see this movie? Over the edge. Over the yeah. edge. Over the edge. Matt Dillon, who is one of my favorite actors. How old is he in that? Even though he's not a great actor, mm-hmm. he's one of my favorite actors of all time. Okay. Um, he's just the first cool sex symbol. Fuck yeah. Ugh. Mm. Oh, fucking dunk. He's the one. I, Remember they used to put the Marlboros and they curl them up in the the the, the t-shirt. Yep. I man crush over Matt Dillon. God time. damn, I still do. Back then. I do. This movie is one of my favorite movies of all time. He has a brother or no? He has a brother. He was on uh, Kevin. What's the show? Entourage. Entourage. Oh, Entourage. Yes. That's his bro, yeah. yeah. And he was in Platoon. Fucking psycho in Platoon. Uh, question. Do yeah. We, do we have any more heartthrobs like that in entertainment? Of course. Mm-hmm. You mean like baby faces? Like who's that? Who's the badass? Oh, I, like I, me I, I, or you like, or something, But how right? young is he? Because I think Tom Hardy is like a bad boy. Oh, hottie. yeah. No, Tom but Hardy's Tom not Hardy, that. T- Tom Hardy plays villains. Yeah, Gossip, Tom Hardy's Ryan not Gossip. that. And he's in Peaky Blinders. That is true. Yes. That is true. He's on my top five for sure. Um, deepdiscount.com offering savings. Listen, I go to Deep Discount. I got this right here. If you want to go to a movie, get uh, to Deep Discount. Right, you want to get a movie. What am I going to get? Go get Over the Edge. Mm. One of my favorite movies of all time. It's got teen, 
angst, but it's the whole town. They take over the town. They rebel against the parents. People get beat up, drinking, sex. Oh, yeah. Matt Dillon and that girl. Who, what's her name? Pamela Ludwig. Ugh. No boobs, though, wow. PG. I, don't, I love little tiny boobies. But, but I'm saying no boobs in the movie, no nipple. I'm not seeing any. It's I PG. Don't, I don't remember. It is PG. There is okay. no boobs. She's 15, movies. Justin. Yeah, I, I, the, yeah, I, mean, yeah. I mean, I don't want to have sex with her now. She's playing 15. She could be a little older. That's a good point. Thank you. Thank Which you. Which makes uh, everything creepier. That's true. <laughs> that's true. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> makes everything better. Um, <laughs> Deepdiscount.com offering extra savings to all my fans of this show right now. All month, just enter YKWD15 at checkout, and you'll get 15%. Off your order of TV shows, movies, music, and more. Support my sponsors. Click Deep Discount logo on my homepage at riotcast.com slash Robert Kelly. If it's not there, just go to deepdiscount.com and use code YKWD15 when you check out. This way they know I sent you YKWD15. Use that code. Uh, the Wanderers is another movie that I fucking love. I don't know if you guys remember that. Fuck yeah. The I mean, Wanderers? The Warriors was a great movie, but The Wanderers <laughs> was a little hokier, but fucking awesome. Awesome. Great Hokier movie. than The Warriors. The Warriors was pretty bad. Warriors the Warriors was, was fucking was dope, awful. dude. Yeah, this was more of like a Grease meets The Warriors. I like that better. Yo. Warriors is, was, was trash. Well, you can get it right now at deepdiscount.com uh, for less than 15 bucks. So listen, here's the deal. There's a lot of choices, all right? There's a bunch of stuff up there. Criminal Mind, Family Guy, classics, including Beverly Hills, uh, Beverly Hills, Gunsmoke, even Twilight Zones up at deepdiscount.com. Go to Deep Discount right here. Click on the logo on my homepage at ridecast.com slash Robert Kelly. Be sure to enter code YKWD15 at checkout for extra savings on all your music, video purchases, and find new releases too. Woo! Do you e. think Zach Efron is a Matt Dillon type? No, um, he's too into his fuck. He's too into his own like body. Is this thing. a back? What is this? I, I thought of Efron. He's like you he's said not. He's not. Um, I hero. Deep he's discount, not heroic. The deep discount. He's like goofy the deep or like discount, cute. The yeah. deep discount. Sorry. <laughs> what, dude? W- would you, George Clooney? Can I ask you one question? Can, can I ask you one question? Can I just finish the ad? I just have one can question. The it's related it's to so the ad. Long. Is what happens in Over these the ads, Edge? Uh, the ads are long. I feel bad for all these janitors listening. They're yeah. Well, like, I feel bad. Why don't we just play the movie? They're done buffing. Them DVDs. We should just play the movie for them. Are we over the edging right now? Is that what's happening? Is this a rebellion that's happening right now? Are we over the edging? No, because that would make me the teacher. Yeah. And I would lock you guys in the school. <laughs> Nobody's I would going let you home? lock me in okay, the school. Fair enough. And then light the school on fire, not to kill the ending. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, sponsors. <laughs> Deepdiscount.com. Be good to yourself. Buy your favorites. Support my sponsors. Watch it when you want to. Check it out now. Thank you, Deep Discount. Got him. Okay. Bobby. What's Boom. up? Fucking... I got a fucking shit email. Some passive aggressive fan who's really a hater mm. tried to act. This is what I love when they fucking get creative. Tried to act like a fan mm. and sent me a fucking shit email complimenting me, but then zinging me and then complimenting. Me. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a premium member, but I just want to say fucking. Take your money back, you piece of shit. Yeah, we what don't need you. Do? What did he say? Fuck him. <laughs> there you go. There's a burping. He said, you're burping. Fuck off. Go fuck yourself. He what? didn't like your burping? What did he... I want to hear the complaints. He was, he, no, this is what happens is that these people out there, yeah. they they find new ways They because they can get to you. They send you an email. And I got this email and I read it. It was such a passive aggressive. Fuck it. I respect the guy who goes, dude, I hate you more than some... I do give him credit, though, because it was a very well-crafted... Tell us the email. Can you tell us the email? I don't know. I deleted it. What was the gist of it? Uh, I'm a big fan, and I just wanted to send it to you this personally because I didn't want to be one of the haters online. Uh, But you... But, uh, you know, I just want to say you're burping and blah, blah, blah. And, you know, I know it's because you eat way too much. Ah. It's like, dude... By the way, that was really good acting. I don't think you overacted at all. That but was it's, fucking awesome. It's it's uh it's like, dude, come on. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then he would go back into like, I'm a premium member and I enjoy the show for a long time. <laughs> I'm a big fan, but you know, the way you're eating, you know, like <laughs> just throwing z- fat jokes in every yeah. couple of seconds. Fucking I hope your family gets Were hit they by jokes a plane. or concerns? <laughs> they were both. Okay. Do you get a do you get what? like uh triggered by that? By no, the fat not, jokes? No. Um, fat jokes, it depends. I it's did, you know, want some, I don't mind it at all. Um, I get it. Here's what bugs me is when they say, they say jokes, they say things online that have been said a thousand times. 
And it's like, dude, yeah. like somebody said, oh, you look like, I had my glasses on, and some guy wrote in the comments, you look like Danny DeVito. And he said it with such, Ugh, like, you know, he yeah. probably showed his wife. Like he felt really good about it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, and then yeah, yeah. But four comments down, somebody wrote the same, you look like Danny DeVito. And it's like, do you guys even, like, follow the thread yeah. of being a cunt? <laughs> yeah, shut up, DeVito. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? It's like, I don't get, and... I okay. I black glasses, chubby dude. You know, all right, whatever. I I don't think you look like Danny DeVito. I don't know. I I mean, I don't so know. So it doesn't it. bother you. The unoriginality bothers you. The unoriginality. Some. No, I the, get annoyed. I've been... People go on my Instagram to just write mean shit about me, yeah. and I always just end up blocking or muting because I'm yeah. like, why put up with it? Yeah. I'm putting up photos that are I make me happy in life. I'm like you. I don't know. Yeah. It's just so weird. I get such mean shit written. Well, here's the problem life. with that is that you have so many good people, but I also have my family. And you have like people that are normal, and they see that shit. Mm. Look, I created, I helped create this fan base. I can't fucking hate them. Yeah, right. I can't hate what you. You can't hate your little babies, your little child. I your also children. don't know how they find me. I'm not really well known, so I'm like, how did you find me? Laughable, and then get laughable. <laughs> I was just gonna say, <laughs> get it. <laughs> and just find um, like old photos. Uh, uh, to, it's just so creepy. I, I don't, don't get. I don't. But to answer your question, I don't yeah. get triggered. Uh, but uh, if it's funny, I enjoy, I laugh. You value humor more I've than your laughed, sensitive dude. to. Jokes. I did a yeah. fucking ask me anything on Reddit. Yeah, some of them were so funny and yeah. mean. Yeah. Then the the guy doing it was like, like laugh, like he felt bad for me. But then he was laughing. Right. Oh, they just if if you're funny and original, I can't fuck with that. But if you're just being a dickhead, I it's yeah. like whatever. I can't say when fans haze you because they think they're like a comic. So they're like, oh, let me just start with the insults because like that's what we do as fans. I that shit makes me nuts. I always say I hate that. You shit. have to put a, a smiley face or I love you, Bob. Yeah. It, or it has to be funny. If you're not funny, I'll just fucking douche you. Right. And this is what bothers me, though. I'll douche a guy, and then he gets mad at me. And it's like, dude, you're, look, we're both men. Yeah. You threw a hit at me. I shouldn't. There's no rule that says that I have to. Yeah. As a man, I have to. You're a pussy. No, I just don't want to see your shit. Yeah, sure. So you have to take it. Yeah. You, as a man, put if you put it out there, when you get the consequence of your thing, you shouldn't be like, cry about it. Yeah. It's like a weird- Well, it's like hecklers when they think they're the victim for them getting in trouble or something. Yeah, it's, it's like, a weird- Oh, started. yeah. You started yeah. Like, what? I was just fucking being a part of the show. I was trying to help you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Then shut the fuck up. I had a guy at the uh, sober place I was at. Footprints. So, uh, footprints. It was all sober people. One, there was this guy, big, tall guy, dressed, big beard, white dude, beard, dressed in all red, red band. He looked like a fucking blood. Yeah, yeah. At this thing, and he and I'm <laughs> and I got three, three of the white girls over here, the the yeah. managers. I got all the kids, and then there's just some old Jewish guy over here. It's a weird mix of people, and sure. I'm like, I'm like, oh, I got you know, I'm like these three, you know, the three blondes. Ah, uh, uh, that's for you, UK. Suck it, fucking <laughs> unsubscribe. Uh, um, uh, um. Got three blondes. All the kids, got... And then this guy in the red. And I said something to him, and he just starts yelling shit back at me. Uh -huh. And then I said something about being um, something chubby, and he goes, yeah, I got stretch marks around my mouth. What? You do, or he's a... He said that about himself. <laughs> like, from so sucking dick. And I went, I went, dude, you know you can use money for heroin, right? <laughs> <laughs> and that I think that got, because he started yelling shit. I'm like, so the, it's like, dude. We're, I'm in a rehab. Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, You know what I mean? I'm here for the kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You work here. Shut the fuck up. Oh, he wasn't even rehabbing. <laughs> no, he was He was one of the workers. And he thought, he was just like, I. You know, and then the guy went over and said, hey, shut the fuck up. He goes, no, dude, we're doing a thing. He goes, no. you're not, he's not doing a thing with you. <laughs> yeah. The guy, Aaron, who's awesome, he goes, he's not doing a thing with you. He's fucking dealing with you, which he shouldn't be because you fucking work here. Shut up. Yeah. And then he wound up leaving. You know what I mean? I didn't want to get in trouble, but it's like you think stand up is the most popular thing that people don't know the rules to. Yes. Yeah, because it's especially shocking how well know known if it's it is. Popular. You you don't think people are like aware of it? They've seen it on maybe they haven't gone to a show, but they've seen it on TV. They're aware of this thing that is stand up, yet yeah. they're still unaware of the interaction rules. Yeah. They're on a. Dude. I just talked to so many people after shows to say that it's their first, first stand up show. show yeah, I can't yeah, even yeah. believe it. Yeah, yeah. It the is fucking, a weird thing, dude. The, the 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 lack of disrespect with just the fucking texting in the audience is yeah. like, how are you like? That's insane. Can I say to me. something though? Yeah. I want, can you bring up? Do you have a Facebook account? Me? Anybody? Can you bring up somebody's Facebook? I don't care who it is. Oh, can I? I, 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 I I'm gonna say something about. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, if I have a heart attack, you farting? I'll fucking die. 
Uh, no. Oh. Uh, I, I thought my, my, I had a pain in my chest. <laughs> Jesus, Bob, <laughs> how, come on. Well, one second. That. Can you wait how like funny? an hour and a half until oh, it happens? You know, this I might have... be a 45 minute podcast. <laughs> how funny would it be? Is <laughs> I blame, I'd blame you. You would blame I, me. I'd say you're just a fucking. Have yeah. I been here since I saved someone's life with the Heimlich? What you Whoa. Yeah, my best friend came over, comic, uh, Megan Gailey, and she put a curly fry in her mouth and she <laughs> choked. And I do a joke about it now, uh, but I couldn't believe it. Nothing came out. It was like what they tell you, like you'll, you know, there's no coughing, nothing, and I had to jump and give her the Heimlich. Did you have a did you, you have the chart her or behind her? We were so high, uh, behind her. Did you have the chart? Like were you in a restaurant? And no, you saw it was the at chart? my house. We like ordered food and we were just smoking weed and we had done Molly the night before. So we were like pretty fuck, I, yeah. But it was your the therapist scariest. must have a fucking field day. This chick. <laughs> like, with yeah, but I'm so open. <laughs> this is great. I did Molly, then I fucking saved someone's life. Did it, it come out crazy. though? Was it a chunk of well, meat? I didn't see it fly out. It was a curly fry. Did you have to go get it? No, she said it dislodged, and that's when she could. So it's somewhere under a couch or somewhere. Hold <laughs> on. She, it dislodges, then she chewed it. And I ate it. No, I don't. I, <laughs> Where I, is it? I don't. I think. She I think she was full out. of shit. She just wanted she you to it, get dude. behind her and give her. a little. I don't remember, but I, you Jesus. know, in the movies, it like flies. Yeah. I didn't yeah. see it fly, so and because then a dog it wasn't working, it. I called nine one one and I grabbed her outside just in case uh. someone outside could do it better than me, and right. then she finally was able to breathe. Wow. Jeez, but it was. Imagine you were watching crazy. somebody die. It's but the funniest thing is, she asked me where I learned to do it, and I was like, honestly, just the movies, like, yeah, just yeah. movies and TV. After or I learned poster to hunt. in the restaurant. Yeah, really? That's where I learned to bow hunt. <laughs> Small animals like squirrels. You really? bow hunt? No. Okay. I'm <laughs> I would have believed it. You're into gadgets. No rules. Um, um, but yeah, I don't a know. bow and arrow is not a gadget. I don't know why I just decided. <laughs> so it is a bow and arrow is a gadget. <laughs> a gadget, a gadget, uh, gadget, like a gadget, like a gadget. Like a gadget in the 1600s. <laughs> yeah, it's a 1600 gadget. It just depends oh. the time. Oh wait, but I do a joke about this. Here's my sorry. Iron Maiden. <laughs> But the best part was her after you know the choking. She didn't know whether she could eat again or not. So Why? it was this weird moment. She didn't oh, trust. Because she was like traumatized, yeah, and then yeah, yeah. but it was all this food, and she just like she couldn't figure out when she. Yeah, could you can eat. eat. Again. Just don't fucking eat so fast. Just chew. <laughs> yeah, chew. Megan's yeah. fun to eat with too. So. I'm surprised with uh, yeah. all the eating I've done as fast yeah. as I eat. I haven't had. I haven't choked. It was the scariest. Maybe thing it's because you're good at eating. You get practice. <laughs> really Megan hasn't been it. practicing. That was a fucking just, good one. Why are you surprised? That was a good one. No, I'm not. I'm laughing. You fucking. I my feelings. I said that was a good one, you insecure twat. Can Very. I be insecure? Uh, that's a great <laughs> idea. I actually kind of like that comeback. <laughs> Wait, did you eat anything good in Chicago? Uh, um, did you make any specific trips? This is what a fat fuck I am. You ready? Oh, boy. First of all, I wanna, I'm so proud of myself because I went on stage in front of a full house. Yeah. Just all fans. And I went, your pizza stinks. <laughs> I'm fucking proud Good. of myself. Just trash I pizza. said it, and they went boo, and I went, "It stinks! It's not pizza." Art of pizza is very good. Chicago style pizza. It's trash. You don't no, put sauce on it's trash. top. It's trash. It's garbage. It's trash. Why can't it just, just be like different? Well, different. don't call it pizza. Call, I mean, call it something else. It's a deep different dish, things can also else. be trash. It's a different thing. I know. Maybe I it's no. Don't... I agree with her. Uh, what's your name again? Andrew. <laughs> Andrew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree with her, Andrew. Wow. It it's might, really taking a turn. If, if, if it's just attacking me. That's what it's come down from. Okay. It's, I'll just be quiet for a little no, bit. Please, How about I that? I love you. I'm sorry. When is that heart attack going to kick in? I, <laughs> dude, I hope I have one. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, now you can't have a fucking heart attack. Oh Drink some water. Give I me a coffee. I just don't think any right Chicago people are trying to get deep dish to compete with regular style But you pizza. say that, but you call okay. it pizza. It's not pizza. It's not a pizza. You got to grab a You got to be able to walk. It's not a pizza. It's but you can put the sauce on top. This grandma slice from Ben. Yeah, I'm okay That's with the, the sauce best on top. fucking okay, but, slice in yeah. this city. Hang on one second. I like getting it without sauce. Sometimes Unreal. you get there where the okay. sauce isn't on it yet. And it's oh, so okay, like one, one second. Go ahead. You put the sauce on top, but there's still little nuggets of cheese. These fucking psychopaths cover the top <laughs> yeah. with sauce so the, 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 the cheese doesn't get burnt. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah. it's underneath the cheese. It's, it's still white. And chewy, yeah. not crispy. I love that. And, ugh, and like the you don't dough, like a mozzarella stick? the dough is fucking wet. Can I say something yeah, about this? It's, it's, it's like wet. fuck Chicago the sauce. Huh? No, fuck I Chicago. like Chicago. No, I love Chicago. I love Chicago. Right. Chicago's a great city. Right. The purple pig. <laughs> <laughs> the purple pig. My favorite. Have restaurant you been? In the world. Have you been? No. Purple pig is let's the go best. on the road. We should. It, you know, um, Chicago's he's a good try, city. He's always trying to get gigs. Uh, let's take me. Um, and you know where I went? Where? I was a fat fuck I am. I took him. Did the you go to the Vienna Beef Factory? I went to, I found Hawaiian food. Okay. Okay, yeah. Oh, like steak okay. with pineapple on like it. Roy, like Roy, like that Roy pineapple. guy? No, like pig. Like, it's like pork. Maloko. One second. It's pork. Neither oh, no, that's like Neither Caribbean. That's Caribbean. Was it a hole in Let the wall? Let the fat guys talk about. Tell me that Hawaiian food isn't pork. I'm What's gonna, a luau? 
I'm, it's, that's a that's a Hawaiian thing. But when, Hawaiian food is not pork. Oh, you Hawa- want Hawaiian got- food is yeah. a fucking moco loco because chubby dude nodes. What's it? Moco loco. Two hamburgers over white rice with gravy and a fried egg. Can I ask you no, a question? Pork- I'm just just a question. I hate that. Do you animal. really think that there were cows in Hawaii? <laughs> Well, why would you think that white people didn't bring cows to Hawaii? Who was the guy who discovered Hawaii? Vasco da Gama. No, Captain Cook. First and of he all, got the women. That's with ne- made up. That's not true. Captain Cook. Cook is Peter Pan's nemesis. Bring it up. Captain no, Cook. that's <laughs> Captain. Bring Hook. it up, Andrew. Bet me money right now. Who discovered Hawaii? Yes. Some Samoans discovered it. Yeah, they were there first. They were there already. I'm talking us discovering it, dum dum. <laughs> oh, so so who didn't look, discover look, it? That's look, what you're asking. Who look, didn't discover it? Captain James Cook okay. discovered Hawaiian islands, and they killed them. European, the Hawaiian, they, heard him. they Good, killed him because he they actually, heard what happens. Well, he he Smart. went on, he went on the, he went and he had nails and shit, and they were like, what? So he he traded like women and all the shit for nails, nails huh. or nails, and huh. then they, and then he kind of got a little carried away with himself, and a couple of those motherfuckers swam out to a ship one night and murdered them all. Yeah, these Hawaiians, you don't fuck with them, man. Oh, they're good. They're I warriors. just want to like Top Chef. Whenever the finale is there in Hawaii, spam is always something I have to use. Classic. That's a moco loco Classic. right there. Yeah. Classic. That's really Fucking healthy, Hawaii. dude. I finally went to Tom Calicchio's restaurant here, Kraft. I've never been. Did you like? I loved it. Yeah. He's what, you don't think that's healthy? <laughs> dude, it's on my diet list. That's what I had, too. You had the spam. Uh, uh, yeah. spam. The it's so that's good. not sushi? It's basically It's a spam version spam. of sushi. Spam That's sushi. fucking gross. A lot of Asians out there. It's not gross. It's actually really good. Yeah, I don't like spam. Spam's what got Hawaii through World War II. Truth. Yeah. I'm a Jew truth. and a truth. vegan. So we, what? None of that. Truth. You, truth what? Same. It's true. It got Hawaii through World War II. So it's up time. <laughs> I can't stand They had spam, luckily. <laughs> they have an affinity for spam out there. I, I can't stand My best you. friend's Hawaiian. Stop talking. Your best friend's Hawaiian? <laughs> My no, best friend's not. Hawaiian. He is. Who's born your, and raised. His name? his name is Bobby Webster. <laughs> That's his name. What, where is he? He's a ho- up, there's he's no half, click. He's half Howley. So he's ha- his, his mom is Hawaiian. His dad is a white guy. I've never hated somebody. Born and raised and in white. Somebody Went to Iolani High School. Time. Really? What? Iolani High School. Bring up Iolani High School. There you go. Come on. I know all about this shit. Are they good? Like you don't even know what Moco Loco is. First of all, Moco Loco is some made up drink with fucking coconut. Moco Loco. Show me Moco Loco is. Please. I do love a nice tiki bar. <laughs> go back. <laughs> I Listen. know they're trendy now. You have the best asides. They're so great. I love it's just that. so endearing. There it is it. right there. Moco We've been Loco. looking at it for like Bobby, we don't <laughs> stop <laughs> drooling. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You're right, you're right, you're right. Sorry. Hawaiian's good athletes like Samoans. Like his... Yeah. I just love, good athletes. I just love so like Samoans. Yeah. I do like a nice tiki bar. They're, they're, they're... Like Samoans are good like in the NFL. Are Hawaiians, are they, what do they know yeah, for like Samo- sport-wise? They're big people. They're yeah. big people. They embrace their bigness. They <laughs> like a big woman too. They're oh, really yeah. into a big woman. And they strong warrior culture. <laughs> Very well, brave. Hold on. Before you I, go back, I like how you just described the, the Raptors general manager as your best friend. He is my best friend. <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah. That is no, awesome. he, we went to college together. That's so cool. Yeah, that's yeah. so funny that he doesn't believe that you know famous people. He's kind of. I thought that I didn't believe it. It was more that I thought you just knew him and you were just playing along. No, with him. No, no, no. He's yeah. He's legit. He's a, he's a stud guy. Superstar. Can I Superstar, see a photo of him, please? Yeah, yeah. Instead that's of a it. video, I don't want to hear him. I just want to see him. You hang on. You only hang out with good-looking guys. Um. You know. Uh, that's true. Just say it. I, I wouldn't say that that's entirely You don't like true. ugly guys. I do like ugly guys. No, you don't. I've never seen you hang I, out with You know what? I don't judge guys by their attractiveness. They should do. I really don't. Hey, you did. I like you. <laughs> wow, it got weird, huh? <laughs> <laughs> he, had, he had both sides of me. <laughs> I just imagined like, that cellar did you write that? Did you write that letter? <laughs> <laughs> That guy's He's Hawaiian? A, wow. What letter? But that, Handsome guy. That's like... He, he's, You've never experienced this. This is the most wild thing a I've ever A white guy, seen. a white person and a Hawaiian fuck to make him. Yeah. So That's not two Hawaiians. Right. No. And his mom, his mom, his mom is like Japanese but been there yeah. a while. Yeah, but you I'll tell you that. something about yeah. this guy that is that is unbelievable. You've never experienced hair. anything like this. Oh, great hair. But you've never experienced anything like this in your entire life. Yes. It, the way Asian women are attracted to him yes. is mind Can I tell you why? Because Can I tell you why? Stop. I want to say why. I have a theory on this. Please tell I have a theory. I think I have the same theory, Go. Bobby. I, I was out front, and I don't, okay. I don't want this to sound racist, but I was out front, and there was- Oh, I love <laughs> sentences that follow that. Well, because there was three guys, three Asian guys, okay. and I was, we were talking, I forget who was there, a couple of the comics, we were talking about, they were bitching because mm-hmm. Asian women, nobody wants to fuck them. No. White yeah. women want to fuck black dudes, white dudes. Sure. Black women want to fuck black dudes, yeah. white dudes. Asian women want Asian Jews. women want 
Asian women want black dudes or Jews and white dudes. Oh, white dudes, right? But nobody, yeah. nobody wants to fuck an Asian guy. Yeah, nobody. Yeah, and they get yeah, fucked. They, that's why they have to say you are marrying this motherfucker, right? Right. Uh, because they, the Asian women will just fuck out the dude. They don't want anything to do with him. And to have that guy looks like a white dude, but an Asian dude. Yeah. Yep. He gets the, the girl, the Asian girls. Best of both worlds. It's like I got one. It's it's. I feel comfortable. They look like the Asian cartoons, like the animation. I feel comfortable enough to approach you because right. I Thank see you, that Mike. you're Asian. Right. Yeah, but but. You've got something else going on, yeah. Which I want my. It's like kids dating to a have. Latin woman with good credit. It's like yeah. kind of like both. No, yeah. when you see, you don't look like Asian you're angry dude, with the sun like in your thing. eyes. <laughs> you, but you're it's attracted rare. to. You're attracted to. I'm uh, not, but when you see a hot Asian dude, you're yeah. like, "Congrats, way yeah. to go, Brandon like, Lee." Look good. It's like a hot redhead or um, Brandon Wu from Survivor. <laughs> yeah, hot redhead. But head. you can name like them on your hand. You can count them off. There's like a handful, and that's it. I'm reading Crazy Rich Asians right now. Getting ready. Who has a hot redhead? Name Megan's a, a hot redhead. Who? Megan Gailey, my friend who does comedy. Show me a picture of her. She's a very hot redhead. Hot, a hot, hot redheads are tough. And what? But, Anne Margaret isn't she? The Anne Margaret's the hottest of all fucking times. I always say this. She's my all time. She's my number one of all times. I'd fuck her now. She's ninety three. <laughs> click she's click that picture right there. We're gonna click. Let me see that. Wow, That's she's... her sorority days. I would prefer not to judge her. On she's no those. Gabby. Yeah. Who's Gabby? Right there oh, next to you. Oh. <laughs> Are you considered? You consider yourself a redhead? No, I'm blonde. Yeah. I'm oh, blonde. she's a towhead all the way. I'm a towhead. I don't know, Julianne yeah. Moore. I think Julianne Moore is beautiful. Look, what she's pretty. She's a pretty boots. girl, but she's not. Oh, Mad Men. Jessica Rabbit. Oh, yeah. Mad Men. Oh, Christina. <laughs> Hendrix. Yeah, Hendrix. 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 she's yeah, pretty, but Hendrix. she's not. She's no. not smoking. Don't she's not an eleven. Oh. I think she so. no, but she's pretty. She's really pretty, but she's uh, not. Can I put you in a spot? What yeah, is please. she? Though? Give me the number. No, <laughs> do not. <laughs> on off that picture though. Uh, Who's I, that? Yeah, that's that no. Does stacked. nothing for me. Those are real really? boobs. No, yeah. Yeah. Those no, are because real. You, they're showing. You're only showing me her good parts. Yeah. Show me the. Show me show her, her on the toilet. If show you her took feet. <laughs> show her feet. I had a girl send me a picture of her on the toilet. Really? Yeah, can I see stunningly it? beautiful picture. Can you go to the? There's a thing with Asian women, no makeup, and then with makeup. Wait, this who, this scared the shit out of me. This uh, it's on Facebook. Have you ever done stand up in Asia? Huh? Have you ever done stand up in Asia? Yes, dude. So you saw it, but it was on bases. Ah, that's the. Okay, I had yeah, a TV yeah. show in it. You know, I had that. We all know, yeah. In it's a, gone in in, in, <laughs> in Hong Kong, and they would say, "Wait, we'll watch this." All right, never mind what I had to say. <laughs> but I just want you to watch this. Yeah, but that's okay. all. People. What happened to her eyebrows? Listen, look at look at scroll. Okay, first go up for the second because the, the one on the left looks like Michael Che. Look, if you go up look, 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 look. Yeah. Just keep scrolling, keep scrolling. This look at this. Wait a minute. Go back is to this the Tinder and fucking. No, what this is, this? is women with no makeup and then with makeup. Yeah. It's, oh, it's shocking. Wow. It's, it's frightening. And they, you know, so. Wow. Yeah, but of course. But what yeah, are you guys what, shocked at? I think what it's the, same I think for what white the argument too. is. No, no, look, look at that one. Is, Wait, scroll back. More right. severe. It's that they look no, like they fake, like a fake doll. Yeah, but that's clearly she made her eyes bigger on the computer. It's great. Scroll down, scroll down. There's one that fucking blew me away. Keep going. The one with the mustache wasn't the one that blew you away. Look at that one. That doesn't... Uh, yeah, it's it's frightening. Um, wow. Yeah. Wow. Oof, so I feel like this is all women, though. No, it's not. It's it's more no. severe. When I was in when I was in Singapore and Malaysia, uh, <laughs> I noticed I noticed a, I was like, where are the hot chicks? It was best food I've ever had. Ugliest women I've ever seen in my entire life. And I think that's the reason why the lady boys kill it out there. They kill it because they put ah. effort in. The girls out there don't do a lot of makeup. They don't do a lot of like nothing. Yeah, they're busy. They're busy. They're working. They're making it happen, which is fine. Yeah, but they... there's a star. <laughs> but you see these lady boys, and you're like, oh, okay, I get. Yeah, it. Don't I see forget, why. don't forget, they're killing it because they got that fucking piece too. They got and that fucking what? six inch hanging between their legs. Six inches. Little, a little bit extra. <laughs> I don't know. Little it. bonus <laughs> footage. I want to go to Singapore because I'm reading this that crazy rich Asian book, and uh -huh. it sounds like a great. What topic. is that? It's a book they're making. Ronnie Chang. Um, he's gonna be in this movie, but it's just like. Uh, this American Asian girl starts dating this Asian dude, and he doesn't tell her that uh -huh. he's from one of the richest families ever. So then they yeah. go on this big family trip, and they're billionaires. And really, I'm pretty early in the book, but yeah. Wait, mm. is it, this is fiction. It's, it's fiction, real? but there's always little stars um, at the bottom of the page explaining words and stuff. That I think it's like um, I don't know. I'm learning a lot. Historical fiction. <laughs> historical no, fiction. No, it's yeah, but it's nowadays. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Me historical meaning like finish it and let me know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love that you said Peaky Blinders. 
But what about I, Peaky Blinders? It was an hour. It's a great I fucking know, show. But it really Fantastic bugs me. It has show. nothing to do with gypsies. First two hit. No, they're kind of gypsy. They're, they're kind of gypsy. Why are you they, thinking about that now? They're a little bit gypsy. They Bobby. say, they say, Bobby. but they're European gypsies. Totally different than our I'm gypsies. Sorry. You have to watch this gypsy wedding show. Will you get clips uh, or photos Listen, of it? I, I know want you to watch you're, it so you're looking at the traditional <laughs> Romanian gypsies That's that the immigrated ones. through India. That's what you're looking at. Look at this, Huge problem. Huge problem. Here, in Romania. Their weddings are nuts, but they're so poor and trashy and weird, but mm -hmm. glitzy, and it's yeah. all confusing. Where do they yeah. live in New York? Europe. Pennsylvania and upstate New York. <laughs> yeah, upstate New York, yeah. yeah. Big into it. Family. And they beat the shit of out of each other in yep. little shorts. It's really like appalling, but... They have blondes? <laughs> oh, the whole thing. I thought... Oh, I was thinking more like back hair. They women. have blondes? <laughs> the fuck? What are you talking about? What when I think gypsy, dress? I think like a woman who's like a fucking yeah. unibrow, yeah. like a, a mustache, baby. like a, a mole with like hairs. I don't yep. think like... That's a kind of a hot Can I just talk... Can we talk yeah. about this without getting... I, I, I'm a little nervous to talk about this. What is oh. that? But gypsies... Gypsies, the culture. Yes. Uh -huh. culture. But the one in yep. New York... I'll yep. talk about the one in New York. They do a lot of fucking crazy shit. And, and in L.A. too, it, 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 they do a lot of crazy, the, the palm reading, yeah. the psychics, yeah. that shit. They, they, I had a friend of mine, he uh, sublet his place out. To a gypsy. What they, but you didn't know, because it was a girl, but it wanted up being a gypsy. Oh my and God. they extort you for like 20, 30 grand. Yep. How? And they won't fucking, because they won't leave. And to and get, a, get a renter's tenant. renter's rights. Right, renter's rights in New York. Right, you can't kick somebody out for three months. And they will fucking extort you for, they'll keep taking money off you, yep. and you and they won't pay rent, yeah. and you'll Fuck, yeah, they like squirm between the system. Problem. That's their their system is to find the holes in the system. Bulgaria That's their system. and Romania, massive problem. Big and money. And there's nothing you could do to stop it. They gave them homes. Yeah. They sold everything in the house. Yeah. The government were like, "Hey, you just live here." They sold the bathtubs. They sold the sinks. They sold all the furniture. Everything there. Yeah. It's a it's a weird weird culture, mm -hmm. and it's kind of they're like cockroaches in a weird way. But but they kill. They'll fucking kill you. They're fucked up, though. I don't they'll know like if they're as violent. Babies. But are there chill so, ones that are like, stop they, grouping me in with these people? Yes, or they're of course. All nuts? Yes, yes. Do those end up leaving their family? Like, I want to know about the people that left or something. How has there never mm. been like a gypsy comic? Who's gone back? He's like, I don't who know comes if, from that culture? I don't They're know. Their house or not? I don't know if they have. I don't know. They might be. In the TV show, they mostly build stuff. Like well, what? They're builders, contractors. In well, what I would show? not right trust the them to build show. anything. <laughs> Dude, a oh. fucking gypsy builder? They're all like working. Yeah. All right, here we go. Gypsy a gypsy standard. comic. Oh, Ready? Oh, God. Jesus Christ. We found a gypsy comic? <laughs> I mean, he's perfect. You want to? No, I told you she was lesbian, bro. Oh, he's doing a character. Oh, That's a white guy. Stick. How do I know she's lesbian? Because she doesn't want this. Who would want this? Come on. You owe me five bucks. Ah. After this show. Don't worry. My gosh. I bet you have any armpits, too. You do? Oh, that's another dollar in the bank. Look at the thing on the wall. Like, it's like a gypsy restaurant. I can spot you fucking lesbians a mile away. It's the smell. You guys have this fucking smell. I mean, he's killing. My name is Ron from Iran and fuck America. But he's saying he's from Iran. Is a gypsy yeah. from Iran? I don't know. I don't think that's a gypsy. No, I don't think it's a no, gypsy. No, I think either. we should. I think we should. Say Why is Rich Voss coming up <laughs> when you type in gypsy? <laughs> I go to different kind of uh, fortune tellers. Which which kind? But the best I've ever had, which is crazy, was just like this fifty plus year old white bus driver looking guy in the back of a Mexican restaurant. You can't, you can't believe he did in this great. Stuff. You can't believe in it. It's not about believing it. It's like <laughs> I mean, he killed it. He really what did. did. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. I just feel there's people that have to have certain inclinations or openings to be able to read certain things. I don't know. What did, what what made this bus driver? First of all, why would you be with a bus driver in the back? I don't somewhere? know if he was a bus driver. That was his look. Um, you but... have a hat. <laughs> why, what, what look was it? Yeah, he had a hat and glasses, <laughs> and he was just sitting in the back. Did he open the door room. to his room like this? <laughs> <laughs> My dad was a school bus driver. No big deal. Your dad was a school bus driver. Yeah. Um, what what what, what did he say? Huh. Well, he said a lot of uh, things, and then like eight yeah. months later, something reminded me of him, and I looked back, and he kind of called everything. What? Um, I ju just, I don't want to talk about it. No, I will. Um, <laughs> <laughs> he was just saying that, uh, uh, wait, I'm trying to figure it out.
I'm you, so excited right now. Why? I, this is the suspense. It's not. Well, now I feel like it's not going to be cool. It's enough. okay. But anyway, I promise. But then when I thought about him, one of the things was the burning tower, and it's about like betrayal and friendship, and something bad's going to happen. I'm like, well, nothing happened. I guess that you saw a terrorist. What didn't have. Uh, that's what like wasn't right. And then I had this awful thing with one of my friends, and I had to fire him, and it was this crazy betrayal Yikes. thing, and I couldn't believe it. But basically, what he was saying was, you have all of the tools you need to succeed right now. You finally worked hard enough, and it's time to like make it happen and then i sold yeah, the but, show and but, stuff and then he's like only after you do all your work you have a show will you fall in love congratulations well, I mean, it's a pilot yeah yeah. I'm oh good excited. is there a part for big papa bob um i've always think about it yeah because it's a let's backup go. nanny so i'm gonna see let's a lot go. of let's people get big papa we're gonna bob. film it in chicago hopefully. let's go i'm already and then famous i'm gonna take there. you to art of pizza um, <laughs> <laughs> but deal like, breaker <laughs> <that's> an, uh, <laughs> deal breaker um <laughs> It was just like all these Chicago sick Chicago pizza sticks. Um, and then he was like, you have to focus on your work and make sure you're working on improving yourself. Mama, can I say something? And then something? you'll fall in love, and then I did. I want to I wanna do, can I read you right now? What? Look at me. No. Look at me. I'm turning red. <laughs> Uh-oh, what are you showing me? Hang on. I'm so nervous. What's happening? Listen, I want you to look. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to look into the penis. <laughs> Listen to me. Look into the penis. Yo, this is wild. Follow the penis. All right. This is listen. kind of what I do with my therapist. It's so perfect. Listen. Listen to me. Mm-hmm. I'm getting something from you right now. You just don't think there's I'm people getting that something are from I, I really want to tell you. I'm getting you something. I'm getting something from you. You're going through something. <laughs> right now, you're going through some turmoil, but you're almost on the out of it. You're almost out of it. Are you talking to me too? I'm, I'm, I'm talking to all of you oh. out there. Listen, right now you you're almost out of it, but it took you a while. Uh-huh. You're almost out of it. But you kind of want to go back. You kind of like living in it. Yeah. You like the misery. Yeah. You like the way it feels. You like feeling bad. Oh, no, I know. And if you know if you get out of it and you come through it, you're gonna have to let go of it. I know. And you don't want to let go of it. There's a part of you that wants to hold on to it. Because you miss it. Am I right or am I wrong? Sure, but I just feel like you're trying to play games on me. How do I let it go, Bob? Huh? How do I let it go? I don't even know who you are. <laughs> I, <laughs> I know it's no. goofy. No, you, I'll do yours. Can trick I'll you. do yours. <laughs> I just am into, I don't your, know. Your failed show is gone. <laughs> it's not coming back. <laughs> you have to pick up dog shit for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Sit. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. But you do what know, a perfect cock. There are women in like, uh, it's like this Turkish on, coffee second. thing. I'm joking. I'm kidding. You're going to be a big hit. Thank you. But do you know about that? It's these Turkish women and queens and um, it's yeah. coffee and then they put it on a plate. Yeah. I just believe that some people are more inclined to I don't care. I out. Look, if you believe in that, I believe... I I come from. I understand some of it's bullshit too. No, I, some people are. Some people they whatever you they, believe, they, they feel you believe. Shit, I think yeah. people. What you believe is what you believe, and you can you manifest what you I want. I want to go to these coffee readings. I don't know about this. The Real Housewives of New York went, and they were on, all in tears. Yeah. Hang on one second. <laughs> oh, they're an authority. <laughs> Hang on one second. Oh, bullshit. Oh okay. wow. Well, I do you. coffee shirt readings. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yes, this drip. Uh, see this drip that just went away? Uh, Look, right there. That's your pilot. It's going to be a hit. Uh, <laughs> you can't. You, thank you. Gabby's the best. Sometimes you just need someone to tell you things you want to hear. Exactly. Yeah, you're awesome. Okay. You're very you gotta, talented. <laughs> what is it? We you all, got great hair. We all choose our lives. You're very talented. We you're good looking, unconventional. We all have lives we have to choose to live, right? Like, yeah. like democracy is good. All right. Says who? It's just made up. Same what? thing with <laughs> what just I'm made into, up. I'm Everything's into made up. Though. But you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we're into it. But it's like there's no reason it's better <laughs> than anything else. Man, there's a big reason. <laughs> no, no, but there yeah, isn't really. Listen, if you talk to my parents, they grew up in Stalin times, yeah, and right. they had terrible lives. Yeah, there's right. A, there's but like a, one could argue <laughs> socialism is better. No, socialism's right not better. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But one could. Not my really. point is like I believe the Knicks are going to make it every year. They're not. But I believe it's a lie. I believe some people believe that Jesus walked on water. It's a lie they believe. You know, everybody choose their lives, and yes. that makes up the, your belief system in life, and that's fine. It's good. I just said that in one sentence. You believe what you believe. Yeah. You yeah, but up choose fucking, your you lies brought... is sexier. Yeah, choose you your made... lies, you go, what is that? <laughs> you believe what you believe is like, I think you just said believe twice. I also, I like motivational <laughs> quotes. Oh, I love them. You're a fucking idiot. I, I love you. Choose your lies. I love you. I follow... Choose your lies. Lies? What? Lies. Because it's I've, sexy, baby. I follow a lot yeah. of inspirational quotes. Joel Austin. Give me one. You went to Joel? 
I don't know, guys. Stop putting me on the spot. Everything right, I say. Can I give you a good one? I'm not, report. Can I give you a good one? Mama, I'm not trying to put you. I'm not Adversity introduces a man to themselves. I'm not trying to put you on the spot. I really am not. I'm not. I'm yeah, just no. asking you because I don't know. Any I don't quotes? know what your quote was. What do, you, what do you take that you believe? Not believe, but because I, I, I lo- look, I like love Les Brown. I love, you listen to like Les Brown. And all I love stuff. affirmations. Yeah. Affirmations. Yeah. That's what we're saying. I lo- no, that's what I said. That's what we're. I'm, <laughs> I'm not right. on your team. This is the. All right, you're on his team. Uh, I he's throwing me under the bus. No, no, no. We're on the same team, Andrew. We I, are on the same. If team. you ever book these two. I'll never do I it again. I fucking really. If you don't book me crazy? again, no, you can book if again. If you don't fucking book not me together. again with Andrew, Wild. not together. This is great chemistry. Not you guys are the worst. Dude, this is peanut butter and gels. You're not gels. gels. Oh. Uh. Don't you ever take J Train's fucking stuff? <laughs> Does J Train say that? I'll call him. He would. Sounds very J Trainy. <laughs> I can't him believe right he got us all to call him J Train. It's such a weird thing. I don't thing. call him J Train. I do. I like call in him conversation, I'll say J Train, and I can't believe it. I, mean, I say, I don't call him anything. I don't want to fight it. I want to feel it. Yeah. <laughs> I was trying to fight it for a lean while. Lean in, bro. Lean in. I wanted to lean into yeah. the J Train. Lean in. Fucking dubs. Choo choo. <laughs> but he's the best of all the bros, I feel. Um, J Train? Yeah. He's such a bro. Is there a better bro? Great bro. <laughs> he's your bro, too. <laughs> Am I a bro? You're a bro. I'm no, a city kid. A it's a little different. What's yeah. a more of a douche? Yeah, yeah, I would say maybe more of a douche. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good. Uh, yeah, it's a good. It's a good thing. The no. fact that you you like yeah, I'm a douche means you're a it's douche. It's a little bit different. You have a little bit of a like a hip hop dress too. You're not really a bro. Exactly. Like yeah. a yeah, they, he's more of like a like I would say waspy, but he's Jewish. But that kind of like, like a, a fraternity, why is that? Right. Culture, like a Connecticut, yeah. like a Connecticut fucking yeah, 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 like, yeah. like a New York. Why is that thing with kids who grew up in the city? You you can be very white yeah and then you can go real ghetto in the but with different people Depends on we're exposed to it all yeah you it's like talking to him i'm fucking born least, and I'm raised kid, in the I'm city i'm kidding i'm kidding at least for me it's like i'll tell you what it is it's like we're it, a team it Bobby. didn't it didn't you talk hit to him me. you're talking to me you understand <laughs> what i'm saying yeah, you don't like it when he talks over you do you? no, no, he <laughs> no right now funny. he doesn't care hold on i'm talking yeah. you talk to him you talk to me i'm sorry <laughs> continue andrew you but, were uh, saying we were saying it didn't hit me until i i went to this is gonna be the lowest rated podcast ever right right i keep yeah i feel like i think it's really fun I'm having a great time. I think time. it's a good podcast. Yeah, we already lost one of the producers. Ran, He's out of here. He's leaving. Well, He's been talking so much. Together. Yeah. So I, mm-hmm. I think what it is is like, and I, yeah. when I went to Spain, I realized this. I and I learned you Spanish. Name dropping the world. I'll tell you why. When I, went, I learned, have you been to Asia? No, I, I went to Spain. Right, and I learned Spanish, and I came back, and all of a sudden, when I was around Spanish speakers, I might not speak Spanish with them, but I spoke English in a way, and I used certain words that they would understand, right. etc. Exactly, like just little things. And sometimes we would speak in Spanish, and it yeah. was like, okay, it opened this this whole new window of communication. Mm-hmm. When I'm talking to my friends that are from the city, regardless mm-hmm. if they're white or black, right. I use different vocabulary. Okay. Like if Justin and I like, are talking give me an about- We're people of the world, bet. is what we're saying. Like what? I'll say bet. Oh, bet. Like if you say- I'm just joshing like, with you, Bobby. Can you let him fucking sorry talk? Sorry about no. that. Shut the oh, fuck I up. interrupted once. He's been interrupting the whole time. I'm sorry, I don't mean to throw you under the bus. You're throwing me under the bus no, I'm not throwing you under the bus. I, really I didn't mean to do that what I just did. He upset me. Go ahead. I got peanut butter and gels. Shut up. Go ahead. Go. Okay. So, so for example, but tell me to go on my show. You I told him to go. go. I didn't tell you to go. You go. Don't tell my guests to go. <laughs> what? I tell my guests go. Go. Can I, can I hold the dick while the? <laughs> <laughs> so, dick. so I, uh, so you say, hey, let's do the podcast tomorrow at two thirty. Yes. I'll go bet. That yeah. means like okay. Like word. I know what bet means. I'm not an asshole. I know you know what it means. I didn't what know. I'm saying is it means I might like word, I might Bobby. not say that to I might not say that to Lisa because right. I don't think she understands that. So no. for right. me it's not for people outside they look at it as like, oh, this person's trying to be black. This person's trying to be this. Right. This is how we speak here. Yeah, they're dumber. Right. But just a lot of people don't understand that. So, and I'm sure that you have certain vernacular in Chicago that us New Yorkers wouldn't understand. We New Yorkers. So. No, but I wasn't a city kid. I was in the suburbs. Well, girls, think, you have your terms. I just you know? think city kids are the coolest. You get to take the train earlier. You're just yeah. like more independent. And you, yeah, it's just. Can like, I say but, something? I think, I think city kids, though, can, uh, hanging out in the city. With my kid, because I like to bring him in the city a lot to yeah. go to the parks here, because the parks in Westchester, the parents are very helicopter parents, mm. where they'll be right there, and the kids don't want to play with other kids. They're very snooty. Mm. In the city, you, I'll just let them in the playground, and all the fucking kids play with all the kids. They don't my, give a shit. But it's like a dog the park. Dir- the 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 the, <laughs> yeah, the kid city kids seem to some of them seem to be dirtier. <laughs> <laughs> like just shit all over their face yeah. and some hand-me-down corduroys. Because well, the nannies are probably taking care of them, no. and they but don't care. You know well, the parents seem the parents though. New York parents, 
you know, it's like the dad's wearing some, sh- you know, some shoes and it's the got nanny. a hole in his jacket. She's right because of the. No, I, I'm, I'm not, telling you. I'm talking. No, I'm not. I'm, I have a fucking kid. Don't tell me, fuck face. I've been the kid. No, you have with a nanny neglected, dude. I, I just was in the park last oh. week. I'm talking about the parents that my are mom at the park her to the park. No, the my parents at the park. Sleep. When I was babysitting in New York. Yo, I love you, uh, <laughs> dude. I'm Bobby, gonna, breathe because I don't want you to have that heart attack. It I'm was gonna fucking. I'm, I'm gonna saying, fight one of you. I know. Not it's not gonna be me, but I just want you to relax. But I'm gonna fight. Really but him, I, though. I, I, I want you to relax. I'm from a city too. Yeah, I yeah, know. I know. I'm from a city too. But you're from Boston. I know, which is a fucking tougher city. Mm-hmm. You're right. To it, is it is tougher. Huh? It is tougher. But so it's whiter. To drive there. It's not whiter. It's whiter. <laughs> it's like very you, white. I like white. you fucking you fucking deterred me. It's out there. I, if you ever look at me, it's caucasoid. No, I was ba- <laughs> straight <laughs> cock out what? there. It's not. It's not. It's absolutely very cock. It's absolutely not. I hear not the, anymore. I hear the black dudes in Boston. I'm like, you guys sound white, dude. It's not anymore. Smart. It's not. It's very European. Black dudes sound like white guys in Boston. In Boston, mm-hmm. white dudes sound like black. They dudes They sound in like New York. Boston guys. That's what it does. But it does Boston feel. accent to me is a white no, guy right. accent. You're so right. black guys sound white in Boston because they in go New York. Bo- we sound black because you can hear a guy go, Bobby, come here for a second. You'll go over to like, a black well, dude. Exactly. Jamal. It is a little weird. Yeah. It all. It, you have it more influence weird. on them than they do on you over there. Here, black people have more influence on us. Yeah, like black guys in Boston use dude. Yeah. They'd be like, yo, dude. Yo, dude. Like, huh? That's like, awesome. Dude. Yeah. My it's favorite. Little, little weird. Well, this is now off topic. But when I was a backup nannying and babysitting all over, my favorite thing Thank was uh, park. <laughs> Was park politics? I loved it. I loved What's seeing. That? I loved seeing which nannies hung out with which, and then like fancy European parents. All the like Haitian nannies are over here. The Asians would hang out in one corner, and there was a couple like white millennial babysitters, and we would sit together. And I just loved watching it where everyone. Did you have a nanny? Yeah, Andrew? it's just fun, and they're chatting, and like you see who cares about the kids and not. But my favorite were like hot European rich. rich did you women. have a nanny? I did. Well, I interesting story. My mom. I had a rash on my ass when I was a kid, when I was really young, and my mom was like, "What's up with this?" And um. This is going somewhere. Good. Yeah. She's like, what's up with this rash on my ass? And God, this, my mom is so dope. But uh, so what she did is- Dope? Uh, That's like, another city word. Yeah, maybe city She's word. She's fresh. Yeah, she's fresh. So so she uh, so th- she let the babysitter pick me up and take me to the park, and right. then she followed her, and she hid in a bush. Your mother? And watched the babysitter from a bush. Wow. Fuck you and in the ass? And the nanny- No, oh. didn't fuck me. Oh. So the nanny would just leave me in the, in the uh, swing Poison seat- Poison ivy? And not even push me. <gasps> so I'd sit there for hours- like a dog tied like, to a fucking lamppost waiting for She goes, your mom, she goes you were there for hours. My mom's Scottish. You were there for hours. And I remember I was like, mom, why didn't you just step in? Like yeah. you could have watched for 10 minutes. <laughs> and she, you, know, you waited two hours because to she see had, how I know long she, fucking. Because she, had to, she wanted to see. Exactly how but, long. Let me tell you. But yeah. how fucking dope is that to that like makes hide me, in a bush just that makes staring at kids in a shit, bush? Dude. And it's part of it. No, that's like Fran, Sad as Fran shit. Leibowitz talks about that a lot, like back in the day. What a hunk of shit. Your that parents person is, right? raised you, and what? so they care about you a lot. So you you got all this attention. Yeah. And the 80s is when it's all all changed, and it's all these babysitters. Yeah. They just don't care about you a lot. Well, <laughs> no. I love my wife. Yeah, I go, much I, investment. I, I yeah. told my wife, I go, what are you going to do? And she goes, I'm staying home with the kids. But kid. now everyone's just it. fighting. Now instead of like get, trying to get attention from babysitters that yeah. don't love you, now it's everyone has a phone, and these kids are just trying. If I go to the park, no, but if you go on the weekend, oh. Oh, yeah. If you go on, if you go to the park on, on weekends, phone. fuck. Everyone's on their phone. Nobody's on their phone. Oh. It's all their parents. Mm. If you go during the week, it's all these Haitian ladies on their phones. Yep. But you go during the if you go on the weekend, this weekend, it was I was trying to tell you, mm-hmm. on Sunday, all the fucking parents. But the parents are dirty too. New York City parents are dirty. <laughs> because they don't have they, you understand to have a house and a kid in New York City, the money you ha- the nut you have to crack. It's, it's a lot you're either rich Holy shit. You're rich and you got a nanny all the time or you're fucking you're going you're making it mm-hmm. and you're dirty. Your jacket's old cuz your kids your fa- his face is dirty. Everybody's dirty. Yeah. <clears throat> you remember that Al Pacino movies he always used to be in New York and he had all those fucking like six dirty kids? Remember those no. movies? I only know the one where he was blind. <laughs> was no, no, the <laughs> Scent, Scent of a Woman. woman? No. Great movie. Charlie. Great movie. It was an alright movie. Oh, oh come great on, great it's movie. fucking great, Bob. Please. It's an okay what are you movie. talking about? You tell me one me? thing that's great about the it. Dancing? The dancing. Fucking end. The tango. I come oh, from a dance. dance family that really yeah. helped that's my parents. That's good for you, Charlie. Have I'm a personally role. Personally invested in this. Have a radish. Wait, so did your mom fire her that day? Immediately. I'll take a fucking flamethrower to this place. This is great. That's a good Pacino. The first thing I've ever seen him do good. 
<laughs> at the end, I don't know who went. Oh, his here. dog is named William Pacino. Pell. That's why. Okay, oh, now you're invested. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's yeah, right. Yeah, I didn't yeah, even yeah. think about that. I Stop using I, the word invest, vested, would you? I almost I got come a, from New York, and we know about money. I almost went to fucking juvenile <laughs> detention for fucking stabbing my nanny. What scissors? What? I was like a delinquent kid. You guys know that. So I, I, was I didn't like, know it was that bad. I always, she had this Irish. I had this Irish woman, yeah. and I would always, you know, I had like no dad, so I was a fucking lunatic right as a kid. Yeah. So I would try. So I would try to overpower them. I just fucking try to stab yeah. with scissors, Jesus and I got Christ. you know sent away. Author, author, yeah, author, sent author, yeah. author, author. They press charges. You ever see that movie? Author, she tried author. To, but she was an no. illegal immigrant, so she couldn't. Ah, uh, that's good. You ever see the movie Author, Author? No. With Al Pacino, oh. and they live in New York. Little those little dirty fucking. Is that kids. Macaulay Culkin? No, we no. stopped screaming and singing at the same time. Sorry. Is that Macaulay Culkin? Yeah. I got excited. Oh, I never was stabbed, it. but there was a group of kids that I babysat, and they sprayed me with a fucking hose. Not with mace. Losers. Oh. No, just the hose. What, what, what's, what's wrong with that? That's I cute. wasn't in the mood to Were you that. hot? No, it was like a winter time. I, I, it was like three boys that were like sports and nothing. Like they were just nutty boys. And so they just. Can you go to that porn podcast? I want to hear this. No, well, I'll pee. During okay. this. Why? Because I have to pee. All right, go pee. Go <laughs> pee. I also met one of my favorite porn stars in December. Who? The Pornhub pop-up. Who? Adriana Chechik. There we go. Oh, like a Russian. Play She's not. You She's from to, Pennsylvania. Yeah. There you go. Chechik? <laughs> All right, here we go. I rolled so, her some joints. That's a weird last name cause, as a pick the uh, name. Can I redo it? Okay. So we're going to listen. And listen to this. Not even I just want to gonna, gonna see how long we last. Go. I like to do this with things. I'm not being fucking awesome. I'm on. I'm out. I'm done. Shut it off. Done. Done. That's not her. Shut it off. Shut but it off. That's not her. I don't know who's. All right. All right. Hang on one second. But it's all right. Let's try. It's wait a minute. Go back. Go back to the beginning. We're playing. How long no, can we last? I think you should go into the middle and see how long you can last. You're gonna have. That's her, Nikki Hart. Yeah. She looks. All like right. A, go a little further. Like a, like a, right there. No looks one like fucks you. women all right, better than her. Stop. I mean. Oh, she straps. Here we go. Straps on. You ready? Yeah. A lot of people leave the business, myself included, and come back. Yeah. And we end up here again. I want to find out from our guest why she did and why she came back and I did the same thing and what brings people back Evan Stone told me you this will isn't be her back. podcast and no I it's a guy but this guy was also a so porn star he's gonna be boring too this yeah, is you need he's an a interesting porn star? interviewer yeah, yeah like exactly. Howard Stern right, could back. get great stuff yes. with porn stars go That's a little bit further I wanna hear this girl cause these girls all have fucked lives yeah. they just have to yeah. tap into yeah. them. most of them have fucked lives they got lives. left on the swing Lisa come on something happened Hang on. I could, maybe that was it. <laughs> maybe I have some weird abandonment. Hit the play button. He'll so, shut the fuck up, maybe. Guys showing right, up fine. Fine. If you put the video on. It would depend on the thing. I mean, we had some that were... Did you have repeat, repeats that just came every week? They're like, oh, oh yeah. yeah, this is what I do on a Wednesday night. Yeah, yeah. totally. That's we, cool. We had a lot of people that were repeats, and I made some friends through it. Um, this is just Asian people <laughs> talking. One of the yeah. I think the last class that I taught it was pretty funny. It was a class. Sex class? Oh, a class in what? Sex classes. At um, what? Shut. Stop. There's always like, like how to make girls squirt. I don't know. How do you make uh, a girl squirt? Go like Let's that. take the class, Bob. <laughs> no, how do you make? Look, like, Andrew goes just go like that. <laughs> <laughs> fucking big long Jew fingers. <laughs> I'm not Jewish. I know. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> Is it, <laughs> I don't even need to be here. <laughs> what My the? favorite porn site. How do you make a girl squirt? Do you really make girls squirt? God, yeah, yeah. You make girls squirt. Yeah. How? I it's, squirt. It's really easy. They make themselves squirt, I think. No, you just stick your fingers in and you it. scoop towards you, and I promise you they'll start squirting. Scoop towards it's you? scientific. <laughs> That's the name of your episode, Scoop, scoop toward towards you. you. That's the name of the episode. Am I wrong, Lisa? Um, no, but you should put like probably something on the Don't write that too. down. Oh, Don't so do extra stimulation told. as well. I think so. Fair enough. What is it? Down. I think it's um, like a vibe on the clit and then getting, uh, yeah. what? But you have to scoop. Know. You have to pull so it. So you, you, you put a pull vibe back. on the clit and then you, you do the come here thing. Do these two fingers, Bobby. These two fingers. Well, and then my, these yeah, you, you get I a little. I can't do these two sometimes fingers. Sometimes when Why? people get fisted. Because these two fingers don't work like no, these two No, you push these on these on the thigh. You get a leverage. Underneath. It would have to go underneath. Yeah, they go underneath. Oh, wait a minute. You're Spider-Man right there. Like underneath. The other way. It's a Spider-Man. Literally shoot the webbing boom boom wait, wait, boom boom see. like this can i do yeah. this in? you're gonna get carpal my tunnel fav- you're doing one of like my that favorite. Just, like <laughs> this yeah yeah boom like boom but come here come here come here come here um, get over here faster. what are you doing get over here <laughs> it's like your kids fucking <laughs> and then up. Hey, what what's put, it? get that out of your mouth that. like this kink and then i put something on her clit i think well kink.com and one you can of my go like this porn sites they have a whole kink university and it's all these creepy things that you want if you want to do and it's like a 30 minute video so there's like one on how to so now when a girl squirts it's just pee Probably. I bet it's a lot of it's yeah. Oh, that's so sexy. So why don't I just how, why would I want my why you would I want my wife to pee? Dude, you it's want such proof. a turn on. I like you when want they proof you did on something. me. Yeah. I like you the know res- what I got proof I did something. His name is Max. 
He oh. runs around as <laughs> four. <laughs> Fuck you, poof, I did something. He's got great hair. What? You did something right, Bobby. Uh, Your sperm have so great hair. Let's have Max, Bobby. What? Your okay. sperm has also, great hair. Some people could squirt with less uh, particular effort. P? Yo, so here's a crazy thing about it's not squirting. All the, it smells different. Yeah. But here's the thing: when girls squirt, they don't they don't necessarily come. That's true, right? That's, that's true. definitely true. And I, that broke my true. fucking heart to learn that because I thought it was a fact. I was like, that is irrefutable evidence. I broke up because of that. I, I, I got, I had, yeah, me and my ex girlfriend, we was a nut. She, she would, would squirt and not come. She would always squirt, and yeah. then like I thought, and she was Ugh. not, and she, and I thought she was like fucking... loving sex and all that. She goes, you know, this is like not satisfying anymore. I'm like, I'm fucking soaking wet and buying new sheets every other week. Like, what's this? <laughs> like living with a here? fucking two year old. And she, and it's not, and I listen. I'm not. Down. I've been with <laughs> enough women. I know how to fucking navigate down there. And I was like, she, it was like a whole source of tension for us. Intimacy yeah. issues. Problem. We breathe when you problem. talk. Fucking <laughs> fucking Tony Danza. When I get passionate. <laughs> when I get passionate. I know, but it makes me stop breathing. I'm like, no, <gasps> that's not what's making you stop breathing. That's true. <laughs> that's true. As soon as I said it, I saw that. See how excited he got? <laughs> how excited did you get? It was good. It was, it was a, great a good one. You got a pee, It man? was did a you good pee? one. I didn't go yet. I'm Go pee. Go pee. Go pee. Go. I'm nervous. Go, because no, I got to go after you. Go, I got to go after you. I have to go after I have to go also. Okay, we'll do one, two, three. Guys, well, all three of you go. Yeah. Have, 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 have we, you, have have we you made, made it past squirt? the 45-minute mark? We have. I just yeah. want to point that out. You already had I got sponsors. That. I'm not fucking shutting hey. the show down. Well, <laughs> I'm just saying we made it past. <laughs> I'll put up your shit the whole for two hours. God bless. Who's better uh, than me or Andrew? We'll do uh, you want me to check? Oh, 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 I think it's going to be Andrew. I'm wearing a hat right now. I don't look my best. The I'm lighting. Uh, uh, Let's check He's the very Here's handsome. the thing. I think that Wait Justin... Wait a minute. Don't tell us. Okay. Can no, I just listen, say one don't thing? Don't tell us. Can I say... Before it comes right. out, I would not be surprised if Justin is, is better looking. Oh, my God. Listen, now, here's don't the thing. Andrew's going to crush this. No, no, no. I think Justin's better looking. But here's the thing. But here's the thing. I think... Oh. What uh, what advantage well, I, I wait have? For her to come back. An advantage I have it happens to be height. Height. So whereas Justin's traditional looks, beautiful guy, mm. but there's Appreciate this height thing too. that girls do care about. They do care about this height thing, it's and never, I think that's where that might be. You know, yeah, but, but can I say in something? this situation, we're both sitting down, so nobody knows. But can I say no something to you, yeah. Andrew? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're both sitting down, yes, but yeah. you also have. Uh, you have this, like I said, you're unconventionally good looking. Okay. So you have, you have, you have like a big nose. That's true. Yeah, uh, yeah. You get hair. You get a bra You get all different little features that make you pop out. Okay. Now he's. What well, you would think a, America, what a good looking guy cool. would do? Go. He's a good looking guy, a regular yeah. good looking guy. You're like unconventionally. And I he's think like a lot what of girls make, make a that. statue out of. I don't know if you'd make a statue. No, you make a make a pizza. <laughs> Real quick, what? like a calzone. <laughs> oh, he <laughs> would make a pizza. <laughs> so we want to get some more votes. On I, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, Andrew. Well, what are you going to say? I just don't want to get involved. Just either. pick one. Well, you can go to the uh, you can pick one. Dudecast uh, Instagram to vote right now. On the pick Maybe one. Maybe we should check at the end of the show. Yeah. All right, let's do that. Let's do it at the end of the show. You're right. Okay. Let's give him some time. I mean, give you some time okay. to think about. Whatever. Well, chance to tell them where to go. He's an enemy. We're enemies. So what does that mean? You're not my enemy. He's this my is enemy. one way. This I is don't, one wait way. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you saying? So I don't want to ch pick him. <laughs> so it's not even like a. Oh, what's, what's, what? the, what's the controversy? We just don't get along all the time. Oh. We just argue. Nobody. We gets do along argue. With, nobody gets along with Andrew all the time. To, and he knows how to push my buttons, and then I react. That's what he does. Yeah, but I don't know how to control myself. So instead of reacting, we just you know. You got to talk to the but I'm, but I'm not mean to you or anything like that. It's just we have different opinions on things. I've never said anything disrespectful to you or Correct. anything like that. Right? You like to push your uh, buttons, though. No, we just disagree you said on some a, things about my friends that were rude ones. But not to you. To me. <laughs> but not to, to you. I didn't say anything about you. You said it to those other whores. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> to those sluts that you hang out with. No. I think you called them dogs. Is what I called them dogs? And you yeah. don't like, you don't like Justin, that he calls that women dogs. That he called my friends a bunch of dogs? Wait, no. when did I, I... I don't think I would call oh, women a bunch of dogs. Because you were single and you're like, <laughs> what, do you have any friends that you could hook me yeah. up with? Yeah. And I was thinking about it, and then I thought of one, and you're like, "Let me see." I go, "No," and then you go, "Why?" Because she's a dog. All your friends are dogs. I did. I would. That never was say one it. of our big. Yeah, can, I, can I? Can I? Can I? Asked. First of all, I would never say that. Can I see? Can I tell you what I did say? And I think you misinterpreted. Uh -huh. I said, "Let me see her dogs, which are feet." I'm no. a foot guy. <laughs> no way. I promise you, I would never just call. <laughs> Listen, wow. I've that's said, a New York City term. I don't yeah, know if you know it. It is a New York City term, and I would never just You're go. All your friends are a bunch of dogs. I wouldn't say that. <laughs> I'm let not me, saying I wouldn't disrespect ask. your friends. I just wouldn't say they're dogs. Okay. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I think there could be something misinterpreted. Do you understand this why I love you? Yeah. Because nobody else on a podcast would sit there and go, that's my enemy. <laughs> you would just sit here quietly and just we put up with We can never get along. I don't think there's one time that we've talked outside of this podcast where it doesn't end up with me 
screaming and leaving. Yeah, it happens a lot. On this one? No, just in person. Do you name call each other? This is the longest we've like sat and shouted. Because no, Andrew, listen, Andrew, you're a fucking pain in the ass. But I'll say this about Andrew. I'll say this about Andrew. (laughs) He's a sweet guy. Yeah. Um, he's. Ne- I've never seen him do a mean thing to anybody. He knows how to make a woman squirt real good, <laughs> right? <laughs> but that. he is. A, he likes to come in and f- be a dickhead. Yes. I mean, and there's things about you, but you can just say go fuck yourself, and then he'll, and he settles down. And it's like ah, yeah, whatever. I'm not as concerned with um, uh, you. How do I say? It? I'm not as concerned with with being liked. Right, like there's some people that might filter themselves a little bit more because they want to be liked, and I, yeah. I think Lisa, right. you're similar in that way, that. You don't really care if I like you, so you'll stick to your opinions. And I don't really care necessarily if if you'll like me, I'll stick to my opinions. I care more about my opinion than I do about the validation of that person right there. I just believe some of your opinions are not genuine and you do it for a reaction or to play right. some game. That is true. I you think do it's things. like phony and weird where, yeah. you I know, this whole that. thing of like you're a nice guy and then some of the shit you say, it's like... You don't really believe it, so why are you doing it? And it's to piss people off. They do. You do Like, the, you like do what, that. for example? Certain discussions we have where you try to play devil's advocates, like these are people's lives and your opinions are. He left. Perfect. What a pussy. But these are, <laughs> but these are like. What a fucking puss whack. <laughs> these are fucking, <laughs> left. But, uh, fucking New York but these are City like kid. Thought, thought exercises. The Boston word. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, because I think what. Thought think, exercises? Thought mm-hmm. exercises. Like, I think, like, I think what Lisa and I do, at least comedically, is actually the same thing, just on different sides. Yeah. You know, you take a very strong. Uh, point of view towards uh, women, what women have to go through, and I probably take a very strong point of view towards men, what men have to go through, and um, I think what happens is you could be just as biased as I could be mm-hmm. in our opinions, and, and they could be equally um, unapologetic and mm-hmm. maybe offensive to the other side, but I don't <laughs> think either of them are different. So that's one thing. When I watch you, I, I know what you're doing, so it doesn't doesn't trigger me because it's like, oh yeah. No, I've told you this. Whenever I laugh at your jokes, I hate myself a little, but they're funny. <laughs> and and, and <laughs> it's one of these things. I've I've I, 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 I'm lauging. complimentary Andrew. of you. I sit back. Andrew. You know, yeah, yeah. I've never seen five seconds of your stand up. No. You gotta come watch. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta come watch. People. No, come. he's funny. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I, I know he's funny. We've done shows. We've been shows together. I'm Anybody say anything about me? Uh, yeah, but yeah that, we said you're I've... a pussy for leaving, street kid. Boom. <laughs> 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 Things get tough. You walk out. I got. <clears throat> I got these two about to go at it. I just feel <laughs> sometimes your goal is to piss me off, and so then I get yes, pissed right. off. It's, no, you do. Yeah. You love. I mean, look, antagonizing. You came, yeah. you came in today and antagonizing me. Yeah, you came in, but I do. I do. You I, loved it. You've done it. I see you do it at the cellar. You'll sure. come in and fuck with people. You're an in, he's an instigator, but he's not. But when your guard thing. is down, I feel we get along and have a great discussions and a good time. Yeah, and he's then, a good guy. I like you, but then you decide to pit, like say things you know will annoy, I, and I, then I, sh- I should just not get annoyed. But, or or just like don't uh, don't think it's like such a personal thing. I just like the discussion. I like the debate. Like I no I, no that's I what she's talking like, about. That's what she's talking about. You come in. This is what she's talking about. You have to acknowledge this because yeah, it's yeah. true. You'll come in. And you'll say shit knowing the reaction. So does Chris Rock. You, you, so does Dave Chappelle. And yeah. Yeah. Wait a second. Yeah, but wait a minute. We're They're comedians way, here, no, guys. Wait, don't compare. Can we bring it down a little bit? Bring it down to me. Bring it down to me and Keith Robinson. All if you're I'm saying, even, listen, listen. Of course, <laughs> don't have a, don't have a no, use you and those two in the no, same. No, meaning sentence. like meaning like when I see when I see Lisa up there and you're you're yes. taking a very specific point of view on a on a topic. You know, I'm going. Yeah, she's a comedian. She's supposed to. I don't think. I think you're wrong. Listen, taking unlikable point of view. That's not Chris Rock or should do Chris Rock and Chappelle don't take an opposing view to get a reaction. They are honest about their points. There's to, to be a contrarian is not what they do. I don't like the term contrarian because it dismisses my logic. Oh, but yeah, but you're doing it's a you, convenient you, term. You, but you do things, and I've we've been witness to it. Sure. To fuck with somebody. Tell me. Um, you'll come down, sit at the table, and uh, say something, or bus balls, right, or say yeah. something to somebody, or somebody will say something like, "That's not true." Or whatever. And you're saying it to have fun. You're not saying it to be mean or fucking hate. You're you're doing it to Just give see, me an example. See what the, I we've we've been through. You know we've been through that at the Salome and you. Yeah, we've been through it. I I don't. It was we're just we busting balls. We haven't done it in a long time. But I yeah. you've done that shit. We go back and forth, back and forth, back and yeah. forth, and then it's over. But you probably the same thing with her. But like with me. I'll I'll take your shit. You'll get me sometimes. I'll get you sometimes. Right. And then next time we see each other, it's like, "What's up, dude?" Yeah, and it's this over. Means nothing. Yeah, yeah. But with her, sometimes. But this isn't balls buzzing. This will be like she'll she'll say something, for example, about Trump that Trump did or or something uh, that like Hillary right. did or something like that. And I, what I'll do is I'll offer 
a different point of view on that. Like what? And Give me start an a discussion. Uh, uh, we had a thing about um, what was it? It was the about last Chicago or something, right? Conversation I remember us talking about was about. Um, your dog friends. The li- <laughs> <laughs> and if I honestly, I, I don't think I would say that. I really don't say think I would say that. You know what I mean? But now I want to see you pictures. Got that dog, so. <laughs> no, the last one was about when Lil Duval was on the radio and he said that of uh, that tra- that he would kill a trans person if he found out he made out with a woman and then found out that it was born a dude that yep. he would. He would murder them. That's Ooh. not what you do. And then, it's not what that's not what he said exactly. But I, I no, what the saying. question was, what would you do? And yeah. then he said, I would. They would have to die. Who and said that? that? She got to die. She got to die. She got to die. Who right. said that? Lil Duval. Lil Duval. And right. so, why why would you care what somebody? Why why he's what, a comedian. What, oh, I didn't. That wasn't the point. So then, but he, he didn't mean he really had to die. No, oh, he's a comedian. It's, oh. but whatever. But let's go on. Let's go on. Um, and so I think that was the last. I'm gonna have to kill a couple people. But what? But but then, what was my opinion on it? It was like you and seven a bunch of people. Um, you were I don't even remember. It definitely wasn't that trans people got to die. I don't want any trans. It people was that there all these trans people are like tricking straight dudes, and it's like my favorite porn. Their lives. <laughs> What's this? No, I can't do it. Why not, Papi? Try it. So, it has nothing to do with you. And, so then then what, and so for me, it's like what? Yeah, just talk over the jokes, guy. Do your fucking thing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, at what point should people Fucking be honest? Assholes. It's like, let's say you go Trip. to a girl and you're like, I want to buy you a drink. Should she then go, by the way, I'm trans immediately? No, 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 no. No, she, no, she should talk? pretend she's a girl until. I'm I'm with making out. Then I take a titties out, and I'm about to fucking bang her. And then she t- she goes, I got something to show you, Papi, a secret. <laughs> and I go, what? And she goes, this. And I go, oh. she goes, it's okay. And I go, I don't know. <laughs> and then she puts it around the side of my mouth, and I go, <laughs> and then I go, you gonna tell my wife? And she goes, never, Papi, never. <laughs> So, so, as, so my point, as fun as that sounds, no, but my yeah, 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 point yeah, yeah. was yeah. all sorry, these sorry. dudes are killing okay. trans people constantly. Who? So, who's kill- who? killing trans it's people? Like, it's, it's like if the world was more safer for them, maybe people would feel more comfortable the, being honest. Nobody's true. But because with Lil Duval or whatever, where it's like at what point it's will you point. not get mad enough to beat this or like whatever? Mm. So everyone needs to be okay with trans people before they can be more honest. What is sure. that? So, is that trans? So my- uh, Are those trans? Yeah, so my- No, my, no fucking way. So my- I don't remember. Yeah. That's a different I think my- here, here, Here's my point on that, right? And, it's, and when I went to Israel, I oh, geez, did another country. Shit, I dude. fucking country oh, dropper. I, we get it. Your fucking parents are loaded your culture. I had I paid for myself. No, I don't know. Excuse When I was there, I, is this, I is that didn't. Hebrew, what you're doing? I didn't tell girls that I was uh, gay. Oh, sorry. Right? Bisexual. And the girls I met there, being Jewish was very important to have sex. Right. But I felt but they thought you I were could have said face. I was. Did you get Israeli pussy? <laughs> no, I didn't get any. It's very hard. You were telling me it's very there. difficult. Oh my God. I feel like I do all right difficult. over there. Now, I'm you, going you with might. my brothers on birthright. But, Fucking crush uh, it. Uh, the point is, that's the UK guy. I, I, felt, I felt like it would be if I told them that I was yeah. was Jewish, even yep. the, if I went there and I really started to feel it and understand the culture and believe it and deep down I thought I really was. But I thought if I did and then they found out after we had sex that I wasn't, they would feel misled. Yeah, and I feel like there's something similar to the trans. I like trans yapping. Argument. I like yank, yapping Schultz instead of fucking analytical douche Schultz. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Well, I think there's something similar where you it, don't like there it when people talk people over you. Do you? Would feel just keep yapping right I'm over so you. So used to it. So <laughs> in your fucking audiences, I, I'm so exactly audience. So uh, I guess that's what I was saying. I want to be able to keep the same energy. Whether some people, they might feel uncomfortable or they might feel duped or tricked or something like that. And I feel like it might be safer for everybody if it's mentioned. Right, you, do you have to mention before the drink? No. When but are you guys going to fight? Like, Will you I'm, fucking, you, we get it. You're being boring. You just went on a fucking tirade. You lost her eight seconds into it. All right? The one you're trying Sorry. to convince it hasn't heard a word you said. Damn. Literally went like this. I, went, Listen, I tried my hardest. The point is this. The reason you don't get along with Schultz, Schultz, you're a hard guy to get along with. I'll tell you it's why. True. He's a confident guy. He is very singular. He doesn't need anybody. He comes in by himself, rolls out by him. He's got his own fucking agenda. Podcast, whole other world. He's out there. He's got shows. He's on with uh, the God, God, Solomon, God, yeah. God, and you know all this other. He's got all this stuff. So when he rolls in here, he doesn't give a fuck. He doesn't, he doesn't need. I he, do. I want to be liked. I want all you guys to like me. I, I that'd like be great. Everybody does but like the reality, you. But the reality of the matter is that like. <sighs> I, I, that's not necessarily in my control, so I have to do certain things to. Everybody does you like you, but they life, don't you know? like you too. That's just fine. like they don't like me. Yeah. Just like they don't like you. That's just the key to it. But in reality, 
you like he said, I think you guys are similar because you're strong headed. You're one of the most strong headed people I know. That's why I love you. Same with you. Sure. And I don't fight with you because we're similar. I'll me and him butt heads all the time, but it's not like I go home and go that fuck it. I I love Andrew. He's a good guy. You know what I mean? I know where he's coming from. The same place I'm coming from. You know, nobody butts head with Justin because he doesn't work the clubs we work. <laughs> but if he did, he'd butt heads. <laughs> but listen, listen, here's the thing. I, I, I he's think, good. I, he's good, I, this I think, Bobby. I think yeah. you guys. He's good, this I think Bobby. If you, could, if you could just say for two seconds that what you do, chicks, blah, 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 and what you do over here, feminism and woman and, and yeah. being strong, it's, it's over here, but you could learn a little something. You know what I mean? 100%. From each other. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, but I, I love the, listen, <laughs> the fact that she said, you're oh, my enemy. Oh, you know, this another time where it was on purpose. It was like Prince had just died. No, we, we got it to was the, like a table. No, 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 we let, made it go, up. let it go, let it go, let it go. It was this a might be good, of, this might be good. It was a yeah, table yeah. of black people, yeah. and you were like, I think Prince is overrated. And it's like, I don't know. Why do you like why? So, it was just this thing of like you're you just can't, a, just you a, can't communicate it without it being a fight. That's what it is. That okay, that I think is a fair argument. I do communicate combatively. Yes, right. I, I a lot of people Charming. know how to like <laughs> massage shit in there <laughs> and, and make it more delicate. No, why, I'm not as good at that. But I wonder if what, if we could ever have a conversation that's not about some issue or a political thing. Or but I do think Prince is overrated. What? I do think Prince is overrated. That's He's fucking been, retarded. What? 27 instruments. <laughs> One of the most amazing musicians, just musician, playing every fucking thing. His first album, all him. Yeah. Everything he's done. Now, can sit in a chair and do acoustic. He's fucking one of the He's most five. epic human beings to ever touch any instrument never mind all of them and he's gorgeous and his songs are fucking amazing he was the elvis presley of our time Okay, and he's fucking dead. So you're out of your mind if you think Prince is overrated. Hey. He's five two. He fucks the hottest women, and he's awesome at basketball. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. he's not wearing wigs. Yeah. That's, that's, that's Prince, his bro. hair. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. his hair. He's a good looking guy. His bum is smoking. What overrated, bro. What no, was the argument crazy. that he's overrated? No. overrated? Yeah. What's the argument he's overrated? I don't know. I mean, I just gave you the music why is subjective. For me, I'm just not that into it. I don't go. I need to listen to some Prince, Prince Trumps today. Michael Jackson. Will he's you so stop fucking it? awesome. No. Will you stop? No. But there's a difference. I'll say any fucking day right now. Uh, the whole catalog. Listen. Fuck that. If Prince, if Prince fuck kids, would we still listen to the music? That is the question. <laughs> well, would we what? still listen what? to the music if Prince allegedly fucked kids? There would fuck be no yes. raspberry beret. Are you at, Go fuck yourself. Listen to the lyrics. Absolutely of these not. Songs. Be like, look at your stupid Unreal. outfits. Get that shit out of here. You fuck kids. Love Michael him. Jackson is great. <laughs> Michael Jackson dude, can Prince get away is from my that. dude, man. Listen, he's See got how a... combative I am? This is how Prince I end up arguing. I hear you. So I understand Prince it, is my not, dude. Honestly, Lisa, this is exactly why it's nothing personal. This is why nobody yeah. likes you. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. And if I, you I, better stay good looking, punk. You better stay good I'm because on. if you lose your ugly. looks, let me get ugly. Let me get fat. Look, Listen, <laughs> come on, let me do you it. Can't, you let can't. me just do it. It's fine. I'm you fighting can't. for Please don't. I got a trainer. Please don't. Do you want to get married <laughs> with uh, with you? you in general? Oh, I, I, want, <laughs> I want more than anything. If you two married, oh, I would oh, do it. Wow. I, I, was if I want more than married. I want to have children. I want more than anything to get married. Not with a fucking kids. trans, I would do it right now. though. Right now. Well, <laughs> I, I want to have my own kids. You know, so a trans couldn't do that. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? They can have kids. No. Yeah, you can. They can't. They can adopt. They can't have the tattoo. Do you know what have means? I know. I was I know they can't have them out of her fucking pee hole. Yeah. You know. But I'm saying they can have kids. They can adopt and have a baby and, and it grows up. That's my They mom can and dad. raise kids. All but right. they can't. I mean you want to get technical. Yeah. I mean, I don't know for a fact I can. What? I don't know. I haven't I haven't got a girl well, pregnant. The way yet, you so I don't fucking know. work a pussy, I'm sure you fucking have a kick about it. I can make <laughs> <laughs> Get that again. <laughs> But yeah, so I don't know. I, I mean, I hope I'd be able to, but I want more than anything to be married and have kids. And, yeah. Oh, you fucking! I do. That's I, I do. I'm telling um, you, I, I do. I'm Listen. jealous. I see you with your with your son. I'm like, wow, I would really love to have that. Now, that's what really bugs me about people who don't want kids. Just to kind of segue back to what it was. I don't want to have kids. Is that, I don't hate them. No, but kids, guys who had such good dads mm -hmm. and relationships with their dads. To say they don't want a kid, it's like, what about what you did with your dad, you fucking turd? So you're right. Are your parents you're still good around? You're dad. I know I, that. My dad is. I love him so much. Yeah. Do, do you? Do you, Are orphan. your parents still around? I'm a what? An orphan. I am not an orphan. Oh. 
fuck you think I have all of a twist? <laughs> I thought you were all a twist. <laughs> no. Wait, 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 are your parents still around? My 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 real dad, I I've I've known through my life. I don't I haven't I've been estranged from for a, around fifteen years. My mother, yes, I'm very close with her. My my stepdad, okay. I'm very close with. Kind of my dad, who kind of raised me, along with a bunch of other father figure type guys. So, question. Uh, yes. Did question. You accept Hang on one second. Part. Let me How do did, this. I've always wanted to do this. Yeah. Question of the day. Question of the day. <laughs> <laughs> so, so every time I follow you, Instagram, and you, you do that, I want to punch I know, my you phone. You want to kill me. I know. <laughs> so, have you found that having a child helped yeah. you understand your parents in a way that you couldn't before? absolutely isn't it it's it's in a weird way it's almost like a gift do you understand parents. when i had to teach my kid to shit over the last <laughs> year and a half the amount of shit and i was like my mother did this yeah and i fuck and you know but here i told i've said this on my podcast before the time when i finally understood my mother is when we were fighting this was like we haven't fought in like around five years now yeah we were fighting really bad. You and your mom. Me and my mom. Yeah, because she's like me. You know what I mean. Sure, sure. And we were fighting. And uh, I remember, I was like, "Why do you do?" That? And I'm doing all this shit, and she's, she goes, "Bobby, Bobby." I go, "What?" She goes, "When are you gonna understand that I'm never gonna change?" Oof. Just like that. Oof. Had, With that voice. Like and that. I was like, "Oh my fucking god!" Hmm. I was like, "What am I doing?" I was like, "All right," and we haven't fought since, really, because I get it. I accept her as her, which hard, which should. Not to segue back, mm -hmm. I accept Andrew for who he is. Sure. He does things that I know I'm going to go, you're a fucking idiot. Sure. But I ain't, I'm not going to hate him for it because I know, because I do follow him on Instagram, I've known him for a long time. Years, yeah. And he's a good kid. And the, there's people, and I know him because the people, other people that like him that I like, and I like him, and blah, blah, blah. There's, a, there there's a thing that, and maybe we don't have this yet, <laughs> but like, there's a thing with, I thought well, about this with parents, you yeah. know, like, like, why do we, why do we forgive like a racist grandfather? Why is that okay? Bet, bet. And, I, and I'll tell you what it is. Bet. Bet. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. What? It's, I'm fucking agreeing. Great. I love it. I love it. Yeah. I'm city kid. No, no, it's comfort. <laughs> like, so few people make us feel comfortable. Bet. That when somebody actually yeah. makes you feel comfortable and they're yeah. like, eh, they say some racist shit, and you're like, yeah. all right, whatever. It's just grandpa. That's what grandpa yeah. says. So maybe I don't make you feel comfortable enough to forgive my uh, kind of animated, uh, antagonistic no, ways. No, it's hard to not think you're a misogynist. Or, or you, you know? could. that. You are a misogynist, though, right? No, I wouldn't categorize that's the whole myself. Thing, as even a when you mentioned Chris Rock and stuff. What do you think, bitches? What do you think, bitches should do? With opinion. <laughs> <laughs> Cook. I don't know. You know well, what I mean? That's Listen. That's hard with, like, you know, obviously with comedy, we should all say whatever we want. Sure. And have opinions, but it's hard sometimes when I don't feel like people Yo, respect women at, at Andrew, all. If a it's hoe, hard to be like, oh yeah, let's chill out, even yeah. though I believe you're right that you should be funny and do. Andrew, that. if a hoe walks up to you Real and quick, says, "Sorry, says men some are shit talking," you. what were you saying? <laughs> <laughs> One second, hoe. <laughs> now let me ask you a question. Why don't you sit on that dildo right here and let the guys do what we do? No, okay. Uh, Too far. Uh, all right. Too no, far. I, I understand what you're saying, and I think it's one of those things where, where a lot of times, um, when you just get the act in a microcosm. Right, <laughs> just you just look at just if I just looked at your act, I would probably think, oh my god, this woman hates men. She thinks men are the worst thing in the world. But then, but no, you don't. Come on. So then you talk you to really? her and it's confirmed. Well, if you do, then you, if you do, you have no right to be upset at me. But can I say something same... though? Yeah. I saw your act. I know you love me. I know you're a good friend of mine. I love you. I know that you're this. You're talking about situations, and it's your. Th I've seen your yeah. act. I know that you don't hate. I need to see the way you with your mom and people. Look. We all have our fucking acts, but you can't you can't judge somebody from the act. You can't no, hate somebody judging. from their act. But even in the situation downstairs, the reason why we do this fucking comedy suicide fucking job, mm -hmm. this fucked up pact we make with ourselves till death do us part with this shit gig, is because we are that dramatic as an individual. We are so who we are. So then you get these people, all of us at a table at a comedy club, you're not supposed to fucking like us. But yet somehow we have a camaraderie. Somehow we get through it. Understanding it. Because look, I used to be more like him. And I, I, I over life, be having a wife and women and, and learning about things. I thought you meant thinner. <laughs> I, I was that too. <laughs> I had fucking hair. <laughs> but, uh, but I, you know, I, maybe you would have hated me 15 years ago. When I first came on, and plenty of women comics did, who I'm friends with now, yeah. who actually I love now, who who kind of we're cool with now, because not only did they change, 
right? Because they saw me. Uh, I changed. And if I can change, and you can change. <laughs> and I have a the dream. Come on, Bobby. Change. What is that Say from? Bobby. Rocky. If I can change. Rocky. You, uh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Speaking of Rocky, uh, this weekend, the Pats no. won the Super Bowl. They won. <laughs> I want to congratulate the Patriots for number six, baby! Because this comes out on Sunday, and it happened today. Tom Brady is the best. Fuck that Don't bitch, motherfucker. Fucking bitch team. I Woo, hate, I shut up, you hate fucking dynasty hat. Dynasty teams. Don't fuck, fucking hate of dynasty teams. Of course you teams. do. I hate them. Did you hate the Bills hate, in the 90s? I hate, Congratulations, Patriots. Uh, yeah, and let me tell you something. I, I, fuck the Yankees. Start I hate any dynasty team, even if they're from my city. I hate dynasty teams. That's consistent. Teams. I, I can't respect fucking stand dynasty You know why I hate them? They make boring as shit. Do you know why I hate them? They make it fucking boring. Why? Well, I'll tell you why. The Yankees too. I don't. That's a New you know York why I hate team. The I can't stand them. Why? You know why I hate the dynasty? <laughs> why? Yeah, well, you, know you know why? You know why? Lips before you you say know why? Little poor fucking Jewish kid from the city never really had much. Hates the dynasties because it's the silver spoon. It's it's they had it all. They had the backpacks, and the, the new <laughs> shoes, and little fucking Justin had to go to school with Google Converse and a little what? Uh, Izod, which wasn't really an alligator. It was a hippopotamus, <laughs> and he didn't have it. And he had to go fight his way to school. And that little fuck now. He sees these perfect dynasties, the mm -hmm. GOAT, Tom Brady, mm -hmm. Bum and he hates it. He hates everybody getting everything because little Justin never <laughs> got anything. Do you like Michael okay? Phelps? Do you like dynasty solo acts? I, who gives a fuck about swimming? I mean, come uh, on. Why would you not answer I, the question? Like That's a cop-out. <laughs> answer the I, question. Yeah. Um, here's it. With fighters, I, with fighters, I get tired of it. Like Mike Tyson's my favorite fighter of all time, and it's like I wanted to see him lose when he lost. I was like, all right, let's go. I, I like to see fucking a Losers. challenge. I like to see motherfuckers yeah, you wanna step up. You wanna I want to see. I want to see motherfuckers step up. You want to relate to the guys. You want to. I like the underdog. Yeah, I like you the guy underdog. winning. You're not almost getting close to winning and have it taken all away. I like. Yeah. You I like, like that. <laughs> I like. I like. Like the your career. You want. Like I was almost there. <laughs> had a show. Bobby. A dog show, and then they <laughs> snatched it away. Now I'm back at the stand. You really know how to fucking. I'm opening for it. Lewis on the road. What happened, God? <laughs> that, that I does, hate the dynasties. That does not happen. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Too far again. <laughs> Sorry about the Geno line. Sorry about that line. Bob Kelly stepping over the fucking bounds again. Patriots. Can what I happened I... to my fucking photo? It's right there. The ceiling the got thing. fixed. Oh, okay. Nice yeah. talking. It's on its I way. Why am I yelling done. at you guys? This is about what you said, like parents understand. I've always not wanted kids. Parents just my don't parents understand. Forever. Do you ever talk to French piss? But my mom. Will uh, Smith. <laughs> oh, what is his name? What's his name? My mom. <laughs> <laughs> Casual. <laughs> just kidding. So Will Smith. My mom. Whenever I talk about babies or my friends have babies, I'm so happy about it. Yeah. She gets the smile on her face. I go, Mom, don't get too excited. I'm still not having kids, and she'll cry and be like, I just want you to have kids. And I go, I I just think that when you're dead, you want me to remember you and realize what you were talking about and she went well maybe and that's it she just wants me to know what like feel what she's i think you're right yeah, nothing yeah. to do with my, my mom was up my ass for years to have a baby she was like, when i'm dead you're gonna remember me what and you Dawn, put me through me and Dawn were together, well, no, me and Dawn yeah. were together for 20 years we were together for so 15 years yeah. together hi Dawn. and we were we had a kid yeah, before <laughs> five, five, five yeah. i didn't say anything <laughs> say she hello. doesn't listen to my podcast she of course crazy. she does no, she gets a check that's all she cares about Ooh. where's the money Here's 20 bucks. Go get yourself a snack, chub tits. Kind of sounded um, like you called her a dog. I don't know. <laughs> um, Did it sound like that? So, listen. Uh, yes. Yeah. She, uh, my mother guilted me into it, too. She wants me to have another one. Wow. Because we said if we had a girl, it was going to be called Gemma. Mm -hmm. And she's like, when am I going to get Gemma? Is it two easier than one? Huh? Isn't one two be easier uh, than one? No, that's stupid. Why? Stupid they said. play with each other? Keep it, they, it's why? not true. They, you don't know if they're going to play. They don't even know if they're going to like each other. Come on. It's true. There's some kids that don't fucking like each other. Does Max like other kids? Max likes other kids, but we might have a kid. He's friendly. He's socialized. First of all, absolutely. First of all, what happens is when you have another kid, it might not be a good one. So you don't want to fuck I it up? I know people with kids. Yeah. Kids. <laughs> right. And one of them isn't that, you know, one of them like, Ugh. And you kind of lucked out with this one. We lucked out so with- you could dud on the next I one. I ain't dudding. I'm I don't want to dud. Gonna... Yeah. Did yeah, your I don't wife want, a, want another kid? Little fucking. I don't want a little. I'm tired. I don't want. I don't want to fuck around. I don't want to. First of all, she's she's older. How old is she? She's uh, fifty-seven. And the thing is, <laughs> how old? Forty-seven. How no, old? She's um. Thirties uh, or forties? She's forties. No, 40s. no, no, no. That's tough. Yeah, that's tough. So I don't. You know. I I wouldn't mind a little. I wouldn't mind another one. To be honest with you, I would love yeah. a little girl. I'd love to have a little girl. 
or even a little boy to hang out. I get what you're saying to play, yeah. but I play with him. He has friends. He does a lot of shit, man. And and when your kid's an only child, there's something about it where they they're a little more mature because they're hanging out with you. So the conversation is a little cooler. When you hang out with a kid who has other kids that he's with, like, you know, siblings, they're kind of a little dumber. Like, dee, dee, dee. You, and you my joke? kid's like, Dad, Dad, show him the, the video with the robot. He's just like, cool. You they know? say that, uh, <laughs> they say IQ decreases as the uh, as you have more kids. So That's like the- why? That's I true. Don't... Because you're having so six conversations with adults. Six out of the seven astronauts. The first ones, the best of the best, yeah. really, the, were only children. But see, my because you're just talking to adults all day. Has, my sister has three kids, and I feel like the third is was able to hang out with the older ones, so he did things a lot. Well, how, what are the age kids. differences? It's like fourteen or fifteen, and then twelve, thirteen, and then ten. So Something maybe like ten and fifteen. There's something about the amount of years of the gap. If it's over five or seven, they're not socializing at all. Yeah. So when they are, they're talking to someone who's much older. But if it's around two or three or that yeah. kind of stuff, all what of do sudden, you got, the Mike? Other kids. What uh, is it? Read that. Do you have anything? Firstborns usually have higher IQs. So yeah. yeah. So many, so many comics. Guys, what we're are you talking minimal? One point five. Well, I have my brother. Points. They're half brothers. My dad no. left when I was two. Started another family with my, and then they have my brothers. But so many of my friends who are comics are only children. Mm. So many of them. Are you? No. Oh, I have an older sister. Oh, you say it with such love. I do. I love her. My sister. She's the one with kidney disease. She's Ooh. she's fucking dying of kidneys. She needs. She's on dialysis four Jesus times a Christ. week, and she needs a new kidney. Can you give her one? Thank God, no. I, have, I, dude, I got a fucking know. whole summer booked. Um, no, I'm kidding. I would give her. <laughs> I would give her a kidney in two seconds. Selena Gomez had a uh, kidney transplant. That's right. Her no, she needs another one. She actually had one. Oh, wow. si kidneys only last 16, 17 years. Okay, here's a question. And you need a new kidney. I didn't know that. She got the. She went. We went through this 16, 17 years ago. The next door neighbor gave her a kidney, and now we have to go through it again. I feel bad for her because she's. 50. Her next door neighbor gave her a kidney. That's, yeah. That's, oh, they got to lend her milk neighbor. for the rest of the fucking life. Him? Huh? Him? Him. Oh, I have a whole joke about it. Ooh, really? I have a whole joke about it. Neil. Can I ask you a question? <laughs> you I go, have Neil's kidney. I go. Nobody wants Neil's kidney. <laughs> Wait, Selena Gomez had a fucking. Yeah. She has a. Oh, so now she's got a. That, now that you have a, nice a kid. Scar on her body. Hang on. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Now that you have a kid. Yeah. Are you less likely to give up a kidney because your kid might need a kidney? Not gonna want that old kidney Not, though. No, I'm just no. saying it's no. My kidney, dude. My uh, kidney. Let me tell you something. I've never. I haven't had a drink in 30 years. Uh -huh. So his Drugs, kidneys are good. I, my kidneys are rocking. Hey, if I can open for you in Chicago next year, I'll give your kid a kidney. How's that? My sister. Oh, I give my sister a kidney. Yeah. Would you give her a kidney? Oh really? Did you know much? Yeah. Pre <laughs> you know much pressure you'd get <laughs> to middle? You know, you fucking. You know, <laughs> no, I'm not giving anybody a kidney. All right, I'll let you. I've I'll never been cut. Headline. I've never been fucking cut. I've had a stitch. I'll let you wow. co-headline with me. You give <laughs> no, my sister a kidney I don't want for seven months. Wow. I'm all right. Co-headline. I'm all right. Split I'm not worried about anything. That's be one of yours too. It can't just be some other person. I want to give you a podcast called The Kidney. And what do I do? Um, on the network. About, yeah, just talk about my yeah, kidney. Just, you just talk about how. Hey, it's doing really good today, everybody. Just. What Ate a lot of cranberry what, juice. What blood type are you? Oh, what's the one where you can give everything to everybody? O positive? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, you know. Oh, are you are you universal? You're a universal donor. I'm I'm like a superhero. Why are you show. fucking wow. dude? We could get a whole backstory behind this. I don't need it. Dog lover I'm all right. gives kidney to human. <laughs> I'm all right. Woof! <laughs> get you another show <laughs> called The Kidney. Uh, <laughs> where's that flat ass going? <laughs> He's got no ass. You see that fucking flat ass? I didn't. You got like a Fred Astaire ass. <laughs> Fred Astaire had a shitty ass. That's why that was funny. <clears throat> the dancer? Choreographer? Yeah, 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 yeah. How do you know? Uh, check out his ass. It stunk. Little flat ass. Bring up Fred Astaire's ass. Show it. Turn around. Give him a nice ass shot. You got any? Oh, I don't know if I can just search his ass as it's going to come up. Hey, you can. We'll come up. Astaire's ass. Oh, it looks. Look at the big fucking big pants. Flat ass fucking douche. Look at him. Yeah, I don't know, Bob. Come on, son. Bet. He didn't show it off. Fred Astaire sure. in tights. Just put Fred Astaire in tights. That's all. Dude, I got to teach my guy how to fucking search shit. How to in search men's ass. Tights. Well, that's because you're not a fucking man. <laughs> Here we go. He wasn't really known for Why wearing tights. Why would you do that? Why would you type in tights? It's a stupid thing to search. Um, I can't believe you fucking caught you. You said, are you friends with him now? Are you good? Uh, with Andrew, are you done? No. I think this podcast did a lot for us. I think it did. I think it did. Ass. I think a part of it also that I'm mad about him <laughs> is because he Such sets me off. So 
So I'm more disappointed in Dude, myself you t- for if I, reacting. That's, that's if I what, a, what it is. That's what it is. I'm more disappointed in myself for I reacting. Get, I get I had triggered pe- all the time by people. Yeah. I got triggered Sunday. I got triggered by somebody. And I got, less to do I got more mad at myself more that I allowed the person to get me. My triggering. Yeah. yeah. So, so, But she just said that she, she feels good about you guys now. Oh, that's good. I feel like this podcast did good. I think maybe we do uh, good with like a mediator or something yeah. like that. Because <laughs> my intentions aren't bad towards you. I, I, I hope but you'll, you know but you're aware of, you But you're aware of it now, too. Too, so you may yeah. be sitting there going, ah, uh, let me just not say that yeah. because she's here and you no, know he's the, not. Well, you know, I, I don't think know. I'll stop it, but I just hope that like I'll communicate. You don't want to piss this broad off. Look what uh, she already no, did. But I don't want people to be like censored no, and not fun not. around me. Exactly. Like on, no, as I have comedians, to get less wanna, angry. Yeah, that's it. And maybe it's you won't be as angry if you, you know that I'm not. Not uh, a f- like personally yeah. attacking. Do you like her? Like yeah, I like her. I tell her this all the time. It, it, she says she when you t- she says that she doesn't like me or she hates me. I go listen. I I still like you. I, I find you funny. Thank you. I find. I find you funny too, and I think a lot of it. Wow, is that like, came. Wow, wow. Why you were in the bathroom a... because I you didn't know where to, to put it. You don't know, but even no. if you didn't, like, shut up, Andrew. Uh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think the problem is I'm more <laughs> mad that you get to me and you. Set Andrew, me let up. sleeping dogs lie. <laughs> Did you just no, call? No, no. No, I'm sorry. more upset. I'll take Can it. we get a, 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 a free frame of all of his dog references? <laughs> 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 You're upset that I get to you. Fair enough. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. it's le- it's more of a testament to you than like a complete insult. I that I can't the, control myself. I love that some of the dick relaxes you. <laughs> I know. You just want to grab it. Yeah. Um, well, I'm glad that you you said that, and I'm glad you talked about it. I think it's cool. Yeah. I think it's cool. And 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 look, he fucking pisses me off too. He pisses me off too. We all get pissed off. Yeah. I was fucking gonna throw something in his head. <laughs> he took your he glasses made... off ferociously. I did. There was. I did. Because <laughs> I was really trying to say something, and you just kept yapping. <laughs> he had the same face but... when he got mad at Giannis. Huh? He had that face when he got mad at Giannis. Uh, but here it is. Can I say something? Yeah. I, I am a psycho like you. That's why I think me and you get along. Because I get. I. I have that. That fuck you. And I don't like when it comes out because I like being oh. happy and fun most of the time. And then when somebody like this fucking dickhead makes me go, you <laughs> ca- have to take my glasses off. And he's, and, but he laughed too. He didn't give a fuck. He's such a piece of shit. I love you. He'd let me hit him with a fucking mic stand. He'd probably go, what are you doing? Yeah. So he just probably. hit me. That hurt. Yeah. And so here's it. And I'd be like, <laughs> I'm so sorry. And I, uh, but, Bobby, that was a lot. That was stupid. <laughs> That's what I would say. Bobby, that was a lot. It was too far. <laughs> <laughs> well, why would... I, this... Do you have any enemies? You've been doing this a long time. Do you have legit enemies? <laughs> Okay. Wow. Where I, I mean, it's a little late in the podcast to say this, but I used to. Mm. And then the one thing I realized uh, is that um, I I really don't hate anybody in this business because I understand why people do what they do more now. Mm. And and if someone does something to me, it's usually they're afraid of me or they're scared or they're insecure or something they did. It had nothing to do with me. You know what I mean? And I judge people not by what they do on stage. I will never judge you by your act. I don't care if you come off and you're a cool person. I'll fucking sit with you. I'll talk to you. I'll be honest about your act. If you ask me, I'll tell you, you got to stop doing that shit, but I'll hang with you and talk to you and do all that shit. Um, There are some people in this business that judge you by what you say on stage, which I don't really think you should, uh, because that's not who you are. That's what you're doing. That's what you're trying to do creatively, which will always evolve and change. You can always give somebody the that they will change into something more. But you know, some people have hated me over the years for the same reason. You know, because of what I did on stage. Sure. Maybe it was misogynistic, or but it was my life. I was a fucking kid from Boston that banged chicks and single and had fun and blah, and that's what I talked about and that's all I knew. As I evolved as a human, my act changed. I got more intimate and more, you know, intimacy came out and I was a little more honest because that's what I had to do and I had to write better jokes and learn how to do shit better and that's just the evolution. Imagine if they just kept me as that, kept me in that box and they could have and some people tried to but I don't. I don't hate them. I don't hate them for it because I know why they did it. They were scared of me. They didn't understand me, mm. and they were scared to be around me f- personally, and they didn't give me a shot. So I'm not gonna hate them for that. If I saw them now, what's up? What's going on? How you doing? Look, there's there's people that have done shitty things to me in this business. I'll still say what's up to you. Mm. You know? Yeah. I don't like going to bed with somebody in my fucking pillow. Yeah. I don't like putting my head down next to my beautiful fucking wife, saying goodnight to my kid, and then thinking about fucking him. You know what I mean? Oh, fucking Andrew. Cox, what's wrong? Nothing. Yeah. Fuck that. Yeah. I'd rather just deal with it and just yeah. 
well, fucking let it go and be happy, you know? Podcast is very healing today. It is, not fucking from you. When yeah. you learn, I mean, these two I mean, really worked any, it I out. I have issues, but, you know. <laughs> when did you start to learn that, like, um... <laughs> <laughs> that, like Justin's an idiot. No, I'm I'm super curious. Like that, like people. Like when you start to judge people's actions by you know what they're going through instead of assuming like you are you are the issue or you are the problem. Because I'm always working on myself. Like she's saying, I'm yeah, always yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. always I'm on I'm always I'm always on myself. I'm all, like I'm going through the last four years of food addiction thing that I can't beat. And I'm trying to find any way out of it. I've beaten all my addictions. I've tr- and I'm trying to work on my anger now too. In the last couple of years, I feel bad that I bought you those cookies. Well, that's all right. I just fucking I'm on Weight Watchers, so I can eat them if I just could do the points. Um, <laughs> but you know, it's I'm going through my own fucking hell. Yeah. There was a time where I was going through sex was my fuck. It was killing me. Yeah. The sex was just killing me. The things I was doing, it was enough. I wasn't doing it for the right reasons anymore. I was doing it to fill a hole. Yeah. And then, you know, <laughs> and then it was cigarettes and, and all this other shit. Yeah. Now it's fucking food and, and anger. Anger really took a hold of me in four years because anxiety. Yeah. My anxiety level went through the roof having a kid. Yeah. Pressure. And then my anger went nuts because of the anxiety. Good things. Gave me anxiety. Of course. Things are going. Still... Everybody, people go, dude, your fucking life is great. <clears throat> I know, but. What is it that food does? That's when I self. Food releases happy juice in your head. It's filling so it's on the dopamine. It's, it's, it's filling it's like, a hole, uh, dude. Getting a likes another... on an Instagram picture or something like that. There's just a. That's why I want to. Did you bring up the Facebook? I want to show you this. Yeah, yeah. This is why I, I put my phone away this weekend. Yeah. Because to bring it way back to the beginning of the podcast, one of you guys said in the show, you look down, somebody's on their Facebook or Twitter. This is this what is. You mean when I sit in the club? Why are we going to mine? Go oh, to the home page. It's a great picture of you, Gabby. Can you go to the? Like can you just log into a, a thing? Gorgeous. So, because I got to go to the feed. I don't know if you're single. I want to go to a feed. Don't know. What are you saying? Nothing. It's hitting on you. Gabby. Listen to me. She's only sixteen. You're sixteen. Barely. Yeah. yeah. Are you fucking kidding me? What? Yeah. <laughs> She's sixteen. Oh, shut up. God, I thought she was really sixteen. No, it's you're fine. six. Listen to I'm me. I'm fifteen years old. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah. She's fine. Buddy, you're not fucking touching gaps. <laughs> I'm not losing another one. I'm not losing <laughs> what, like, like this, was there a first that I? Um, I not keep you. <laughs> Someone else. One I lost at Meats and Cheeses. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I want to name one of my albums or specials that. Just meats and sign meats and in. Cheeses, I love it. <laughs> I can't use my personal one. So. Why? Uh, just, yeah. Who cares? You got too much shit Why? Yeah, I mean, there's pictures of my wife and stuff on there. I mean, it's not. Okay. Can we sign into YKWD? What do you what do you need to get on there? Maybe I just want to show them on. something, but my producer's stalling my thought process because he won't sign into one. But what what is it you want to show? I want to show you. I can't explain it. You can't just tell me. Oh, this is my anger. I'm being triggered, That's and I'm not going to be triggered. <laughs> Could somebody help me? I like when we're on Gabby's Facebook. Hey, Mike, can you please just like try to sign in? I kind of like that. But yeah, the item in itself. That's the whole thing with. I don't want to go to your personal. Pa- I just want to go to the ho- the home. The home. See where the home is. Teddy's Other car people's shells. Shit. What's going on? The shit on? that you follow. Yeah, I want to go to that. Scroll down. Now scroll down to video. Scroll down. Watch this. Scroll down. Oh, in the middle. In the the home. Yeah. Scroll down. Scroll. 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 Find a video. Scroll. 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 Who do you follow? There was one right up there. Video. Scroll down. Do you have any videos? I don't know. That's what other people do. Can you not have a tone? Oh, video. Right Definitely. there. Good. Yeah. All right. So click on that. Now click on it. Feet. Click on it. Bring it. Bring it to the page. On the protector. Oh. Don't it do doesn't do it on the fucking guy. on the computer, huh? What's the deal? Uh, all right, forget it. Cancel well, it. I, uh, what, are you, what are you saying? Sorry, Mike. Um, Here we go. Okay, so now there's another video. Isn't there like another video underneath this? Oh, yeah. I'll take the case. Can't wait to see that, by the way. Oh, I love it. Isn't like there that. another video somewhere? Actor? Uh, it'll do that on the phone version. Well, the okay, phone so on the phone, this is why the phone, this is why they got us okay. on the phone. I'm sorry, Mike and everybody for having to go through that horse shit. <laughs> on the phone version, if you click on a video, mm-hmm. it brings you to a video, but underneath the video are all the other videos connected to that person's video. Oh, yeah, you really okay? couldn't have explained that before. So, so here it is, right? <laughs> so, But if you go to this, you'll click on that video, then there's another video. Right. And underneath that, then yeah. there's a dog with snow, which you'll watch for yeah. five minutes. <laughs> Right, and then under that, <laughs> there's a string there's of videos. Right, but but if you go to it, and now, then the, if before, you click on it, it brings you to another. So it's a never-ending thing before of, you of a lady making a this, ham. 
This is and then exactly what Laughable does. <laughs> yeah, but Laughable does it for one thing. Ah, okay. I, this thing takes me from a dog in snow <laughs> to some lady making ham mac and cheese. No, it's a big issue. Like the, all the Silicon Valley dudes, like all the people that make the things, yeah. Yeah. they don't use their phones at night. They do they not. They downstairs. They don't let their did kids you see, have phones. Did you see, there was a dude like, who, the people that make it know how dangerous it is. Did, they don't use it. Yeah. It's like there public was a, school. There was a video, I can't remember which guy it was, but he was one of the original creators of Facebook and they were asking about all the shit. He's like, there is no screens in his house. He goes like, when you're on the inside of it, we know how the whole dopamine effect of it, yeah. what it has in kids. Steve Jobs did not let his kids Dude. use any of his products. Dude, I love, I, I want to get a fucking flip phone. It's like, I swear, I love my comment. Like, Attell doesn't have a fucking, he, he everything's on a fil phone, but he only, he, it's fucking away in his bag. Yeah. He has to send like a tweet I, out, puts it back away. I want to come home. I want to, when you come home. I find myself reaching for it the second I wake up. Second I wake up, yeah. dude. It's like I, I have, it's, dude, I have a guys? whole fucking bit about having a, an addiction to it. It is. It's, it's a like a cigarette. fucking cigarette. It's boom. Uh, okay, okay. All right, fine, fine. I'll watch days. Survivor with my roommate, and I'll be like, wait, what happened? And she's also on her phone. She's like, I don't know. So we have to constantly, because we're just on our phone. So I watched this show on Netflix called Dark, and it, and it, it's, it has uh, subtitles. And it was the most fun watching a show that I've had in years because I couldn't be on my phone. Yeah. I wouldn't know what was going on in the show because it's German unless I read the subtitles. And I actually have paid attention. Have you been attention. there, too? I actually have. I went to Oktoberfest. <laughs> uh, hosted the I MAs. I had a lot of fun out in Germany. It was great. They actually the re-released it. They've been, they've been dubbed now. It's one of the few shows they, they dubbed, dubbed it, out. and it's stupid that they dubbed it. Watch it with the subtitles yeah. just so you focus. Ingrid Hang goes on. west. Hang on one second. I just got to check my email. Ingrid goes um. west. It's on Hulu. It's an incredible movie. Aubrey yeah. Plaza. Oh, Aubrey Plaza. Did yeah. you watch it? No, I haven't seen it, but I've been I think, I Ice think... Cube's son is in it. He's so cute, but yeah. it is. O'Shea. He's cute. Um, yeah, this movie is incredible. I've watched it three times already. I don't understand I why it. this, why her. people that go to a comedy club don't, sh there's an option to shut your phone off. Why wouldn't you just shut it airplane off? Airplane mode? And no, just shut it, like right. literally, fuck airplane mode. Airplane okay. is still on. I'm saying hit the off button. Dude. When I go to a play, I do that. Mm -hmm. Fuck it. But why can't we do that? Like go home. When you go home, I would love. I, I it's think I'm just I use gonna it as an alarm clock. I have to get an alarm clock then, because that's the whole thing. I use. No, you put it. You could put clock. it. You can still put it in the other room and hear it, or use your iPad or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> but <laughs> that's what I do. I love that he backed I put it in the other room. No, I, that's what I do. No, I if I don't have to wake up in the morning, Dude. I come home and I turn it off, and then I try to. I, stop. Just I took a te I took a morning. test to see if I have a digital addiction. I talk about. It. I took the fucking test I on. You, I took the test online I first of all. dummy. No, it was all these questions to help you determine if you have like a cell phone addiction. I answered yes to all of them. Yeah, me too. Jesus. I have one. I listen. I, I was sitting there. One hundred percent. I was sitting there with my kid the other day. I was sitting there with my kid the other day, and he was Does talking he to me. He has an iPad, but every every app on it is learning, and he can go to kids YouTube for like twenty minutes, and it's out, and then he's done. Wow. And that's it. But everything on there is ABCs or counting mm -hmm. or whatever the fuck it is, or you know, um, uh, shapes. And stuff like that. We did not put any fucking silly games, yeah. dude. Uh, on his app, everything is learning. But because they make us dumber, I, these I, games. I'm fucked though. I no, can't no, not stop. Even that. Think about like GPS, right? Back when we had to look at maps, when we had to look at maps. We had to remember how streets work. I couldn't what, get I'm gonna, anywhere I'm gonna say without GPS. I'm going to say something about this. Actually, every human being internally has a GPS, and they say that because of our phones we're weakening that right we're yeah. weakening our, yeah. our natural instinct yeah. gps that we are born with yep yep it's dying in people dude so if there was a blackout a think about how thing. helpless you oh, would we'd be. be fucked you'd be and, fucked no one knows how to hunt and no one it's so true and, and it's a tricky thing when it comes to these uh these like apps and and uh devices that help us because do you feel good about what just happened with? no what happened with you and her do you feel better oh way better yeah 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 because yeah, i never had any animosity yeah. it was towards, calm it was calm the whole yeah. time yeah yeah i think you were a really good mediator but anyway, that, but <laughs> you've, so you guys are gonna be friends now? Yeah, I think I, I think we'll like we'll, we'll we're setting the foundation for that. Wow, you know I mean? well, are you gonna fuck it up by saying something stupid someday? I'm not say, yeah, of course I'm gonna fuck it up. Obviously, that's what I do. But I think that uh, <laughs> it won't be personalized. <laughs> you know what I mean? I think that's what it is. <laughs> but idiot. my point is, these things that are making us dumber, yeah, right? You look like a soccer hooligan. <laughs> Were you in the UK? I do Holy feel like shit! A, my little, with my short polo shirt. Yeah, you little fucking mushy. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> let's ooh, go, ah, Leicester. Ah, ooh, ah. Come on, Leicester. <laughs> Leicester. I was just no, listening. Nope. Okay, uh, all right, guys. You guys <laughs> stepping on each other. Oh, fuck. Okay, shit. It's just a the chant they do. What did I miss? Like, ah, point. Point is, the apps. Dude. The apps are making us are are, are making us I, dumber. 
I think it is. Because there are things that our brains are supposed to do, like know what fucking street to go down. North and south. East north and, and south, west. east and west. Little shit like that. Even the yeah. weather. Like, I don't go outside. I'm like, weather. And yeah. then it'll tell. Like, it's. Do you well, mind? I have the. I have the. Uh, I think I, uh, I have the uh, Alexa. Dude, and nice. I fucking love it because I'd be like, uh, Alexa, what's the weather? Alexa, what's traffic? It tells me how long it's going to take me to get to the cellar. So here's the thing it about Alexa. It tells me everything. Here's the thing about Alexa. No. And she's a, a bitch hoe. Whatever. She's, she's, <laughs> a, she's a dog. She's a dog. <laughs> she's a dog. She's a dog. She can't be trusted. She's a yeah. six and a half. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's it. Jersey Tops. six. Tops. <laughs> so, uh, Alexa. Hey, Alexa, how come you're so fucking ugly? You cunt. <laughs> I'll make you come. <laughs> 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 this is the first time I laughed this whole podcast. <laughs> this is the first time you let your pussy untighten. Yeah. <laughs> now that you and Andrew are friends again. Yay! <laughs> so if you're not uh, paying for a, for a, if you're not paying for a what is it? If you're not paying for a service, you are you are the product. Yeah. If you're not paying for a service, you are the product. Right. So Alexa is a perfect example of that. You're not paying for this Alexa device. Yes, no. Right? But what they're doing is they're listening to every conversation you have. You start talking about NCAA, yeah. and all of a sudden you scroll on Instagram. You know, the guy listening to my car on the other end is going, <laughs> me and my wife, what are you going to make for dinner? What's for lunch? What's for breakfast? And then the next day, <laughs> What's for lunch? you What's get a for bunch dinner? of advertisements <laughs> from Blue Apron like, yeah. hey, we can make shit for you. You're well, like, They're actually a fuck? sponsor of the show. Dude. Dude. We, we love them. They're <laughs> we listening love to everything you say. The same thing with text. I'll text my boys random shit about basketball games. All yeah. of a sudden on Instagram, all of us are getting these basketball tickets advertisements. Is that why I got fucked? And she mail things. Yes, <laughs> motherfucker. Me and Norton had a yes, sex change yeah, operation. Absolutely. Well, no, what do you mean? What are you? What are you fucking? Gonna, what are you? A party pooper? What the fuck's wrong. I don't want a pocketbook. I don't want a change purse. My fucking my my. It's true. My keep that thing strapped in there, young lad. My niece and nephew. These kids. It's like my. I and I hate to shit them. It's like my sister's constantly on the phone. Yes. And then whenever she needs a babysitter, the kids start whining. It's like screen in front of them. They can't. The second they sit at a table, eat iPads, and they all have little oh phones. My God. No take, good, dude. We sit down at no 5 30, 6 o'clock every day when I'm home. Mm -hmm. And when I'm not home, my, my wife still does it. Sit at the table. And we all listen to YKWD. No, you have dinner. Yep. No fucking toys. Mm -hmm. Your food isn't a fucking toy. You eat your food. And when Strap you're done, the then you can go and, 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 and play with something or do something. And we have, at night, we have uh, we have a movie at night. You can watch a movie at night, not during the fucking day. The TV's off. You play a game. You have... Uh, this is what I do. I, my, you I know what I do with my kids? I'll take, I take him to Home Depot, mm -hmm. and I'll let him find something that he wants. Like you know, they they, they have these um, ties. They're uh, like plastic. They're Duct metal, tape. but they're they're plastic. So you kind of wrap wires up with them or hoses, and they're like really big things. He's like, I want that. And we went, we got it. He got one for each of his friends. Mm -hmm. These kids played with the. I looked over. One made a heart. The other one made like a horse. Mm -hmm. Out of this <laughs> shit, I got out of for fucking three dollars at Home Depot. Mm -hmm. My kid played with for literally almost an hour and a half with his other two friends. That's the Puerto Rican iPad, bro. <laughs> well, it's the it's what it is is his using brain, your fucking brain and his creativity yeah. right. and his hands and his eye hand coordination putting shit together to have fun and entertain himself. Right. Can we go back to the dinner thing that you said about the family dinner? Yeah. I was talking to Bonnie and I and you know Bonnie has a daughter and I asked Bonnie, I was like, how do you like <laughs> you instill mean, confidence in your daughter? She also has a husband. She, yeah, but we don't want to talk about that. <laughs> so So I was like, how do you like make your kid confident? Like yeah. what is the yeah. like you know what is the trick to yeah, do yeah. that? You know? And uh, and she goes, you know what I think it is? I think it comes down to listening. And I started to remember and I think I developed any sense of confidence that I had from mm -hmm. family dinner. I would sit down at dinner. My parents would just ask me how my day was, yep. and I felt like someone fucking cared Fuck about you, how my dude. day was. <laughs> and, 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 and think about Fuck that. Fuck you. No, but think about I'm that right there. Fuck the show, dude. I'm out of here. No, listen. I mean, listen. I think I won. I think I won. Did I win? No. <laughs> oh, let's see. Who won? No, no. But I, but it's fucking a, happy childhood. Go fuck no, yourself. No, it's, it's, it's for real. <laughs> I know it is. I know. <laughs> Uh, they got back together. Stabbing now, the babysitter for attention. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so on your side, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> oh, what? Fucking broken home I come from. Like, come on. Look, listen. It work out like this. Listen, fucking, I dealt with shit. hatred bro. Okay, my mom is, you know, mental illness, all this kind of stuff. I have my fucked up things too. Don't worry. But that being said, <laughs> qualify your fucking. Listening, we sat down. Listening to your kids. We had dinner every day. Everybody listened every day. Yeah, and Max How is the new you. Fuck me. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. No.
<laughs> you're gonna make, if you better make it better in this sentence. What? Go. What? What? You and Alan. The greatest part that you get to have a kid is that you get to. He gets to Fix not that shit. happen. What happened yeah. to you? I have a porn addiction. That's not even. We're not even close to that. <laughs> Which kind of porn? Who doesn't have a porn addiction? I, love porn. I still yeah. have a porn addiction. Yeah. Porn addiction. Just, That's the, the worst road. thing you got is a well, porn addiction? No, it's one road. of the things you I got. How many times I fucking fell asleep with an iPad on my chest and a load in my belly button? <laughs> Fucking eight minutes after I got into the Holiday Inn Express. <laughs> you wake up with a cum ice cube. And then my, my FaceTime goes off and it's my son. And I got to hurry up and fucking clean up and put a shirt Andrew's on. Andrew's lessons on self-confidence from dinner with his family. Oh, Bonnie, oh. Bonnie. It was Bonnie that, that really put him in place. We all heard what you pissed said. off. I just thought You're it mad. was pretty cool. I am mad. Why are you mad? You know what? Him. Everyone healed. Now it's my turn. <laughs> what? I want to hear. What I'm sorry to yell. What I'm sorry, Mike, about your fucking sensitive. I love my dad ears. Okay. No, I gotta pee. But it's okay. <laughs> Why? What's wrong? We need no. What's wrong, buddy? Let Listen, it out, baby. This is who I am. We're all this healing. is who I am. Okay. No, what happened? No. What happened? No. Talk no, to no, me. No, Look at me, Justin. Out. No one. Let I it didn't out. Like you. Put the dick down. Justin. Put the dick down. Why is it so sticky? Justin. <laughs> Let Don't it out. Ask that? Don't ask that. We'll get that Justin, on camera, by the when way. When I would go through hard times like this, I would sit both of my parents down, and right. then I would tell them all yeah, I would sit the producers down at MTV <laughs> in my trailer, and we'd all just talk it out in between, in Prague. In between takes. In Prague. And then I'd be yeah. like, you know what? I'm like, you know, I'm okay now. I'm not yeah. going to fuck a Jewish girl when I'm off in no, uh, it's true. Israel. One time in Argentina. I, I needed to yell. Uh, You've been, been to Argentina? Yell. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Witchcraft. Because <laughs> he's really going through it. It's so real. Are you in therapy or no? Oh yeah, I fired Alan because he stinks. <clears throat> really? Did you? Yeah. Why Good what for you. I went to CBT. I'm, dude, if you ask me, I was like, if you if you think you're like breaking ground with me with telling me about like my past and stuff, I was like, dude, you're like, I've been in therapy since I'm fucking four. You're oh, not yeah, you're breaking pro. anything new. Yeah. With that me. sounds like you opened up to I him. I was like, I did. I, I <laughs> dude, I cried in that office, all that kind of shit. I'm like, dude, you got The only thing that works is like cognitive changing your fucking behaviors. Yeah. If you sit, yeah. you can't sit there and look and like tell the same story again. Like this is why this happened and this is why it, it, I know. Mm. Motherfucker, your brain is firing in a set pattern, mm -hmm. and unless you change that, unless you physically change what you're doing, mm -hmm. you're just talking about the same pattern. It's fine. You're not gonna have yeah. some elucidated meaning of something. So who do you go to now? Nobody. No, I go to CBT. I What's that? Cognitive, Cognitive behavioral, behavioral therapy. Where's that? I do, I Skype with this dude in England. He's a fucking black belt at this shit. And what does he do? We talk about like we we rage. We look, no, we don't. This Anger. Our, you're changing your behavior. Yeah, we talk about flipping out on podcasts. Is this about you or me right now? <laughs> <laughs> it's about you fucking throwing my chair. We talk. I didn't throw the chair. You I it. loved it. I thought it was such no, a I real moment for you. I think we should stay in it. What are you talking about? That's what my dad would tell we me. We basically we 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 discuss like the thing. The <laughs> What a cunt. <laughs> wow. Justin, sit down. I love you. Stop it. Come on, sit down. There's no taking me down when I get like this. Sit down. Listen, come on. When my button gets hit, I get. I got to go to the gym right now. Listen to me. <laughs> I got to go to the gym right Women, now. Women, do, do push-ups. Yeah. Do push-ups. I'm cognitively I need a fucking, I need to deadlift. Listen. <laughs> Uh, put Mike lot. on your shoulder. Right. Mike, deadlift Mike. That's not enough. That's come on, Justin. Enough. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Listen to me. I'm listening. Listen to me. Listen yeah, to me. This is a genuine fucking Justin, moment right Justin. here. This is real Ooh. shit. Sit. Up. Down. Stay. God, I feel so close to you right Up. now. Isn't it weird how like that vulnerability really brings you in? Like What happened? Listen. Yeah, talk to us, man. We're talking, bro. Tell I mean, us what the fuck th happened. We dude. go. We what a cunt. No, we talk about. Serious. Nobody likes. Nobody likes Schultz. <laughs> no, I'm being dead serious. Everybody I'm, hates I'm Schultz. Drawn to you. I've not moment. liked him. You hated him. Justin, listen. who was his partner at the beginning, doesn't Guys, like him now. Listen. Gabby hates him. <laughs> well, to that I say, maybe it's you. <laughs> Maybe it's you guys, okay? That's what my parents would tell me over lasagna every day, okay? They'd say it's those people, not you, Andrew. It's You're a sweetheart. It's bubbling. Listen, it's I know, bubbling. but you were no, just he's explaining. He's a fucking real moment. I want to hear about I have it. So, this is, I have all real moments. I'm you, a real motherfucker. The winner um, of course. is... Wait, 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 wait. break your wait, fucking now, back. Let me tell you Don't how sensitive you I am right now. Listen, let me tell you how sensitive right now. That the phone winner. could end up in the fucking toilet. If it's not my name, the winner. Yes, is Justin. Hey! There we go. The thing, that, the thing that always makes it better. The thing that always makes it better. The only thing I have, bro. Yeah. The only thing I have. I'm gonna be at Magoobies this weekend. <laughs> Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. 
Uh, Mugubi's in uh, in uh, Maryland, and then I'm going to Parlor Live in Bellevue, Washington. Oh yeah. On the uh, 8th, 9th, and 10th, which I'm very excited. And then I'm at the Fat Black Pussycat. Valentine's I'm Day. I'm putting it together. Good show for Valentine's Day. Um, uh, Rich Voss is already uh, is on it. Uh, it's already sold out, so I can't even. It's sold out. Valentine's Day show. You can you can show up for standby, but I it's already sold out. It's going to be a great show. Uh, hey, is it sold out? Sold out. Wow, that's amazing. Well, well it's not it's fucking 16 people. Um, <laughs> and then uh, I got so many good shows. Wood Theater. Uh, in Glen Falls, New York, uh, uh, Cahoos Music Hall, Uncle Vinny's, Fat Black Again, Mystic Showroom. So many good shows How is coming the Carlson? up. Carlson? RobertKellyLive.com. I don't know. I'm placing That's that for in Rochester, time. right? Yes, it is. Yeah. Uh, uh, so go to RobertKellyLive.com for all my tickets. Please, if you go to the show because of the podcast, come up to me after the show and let me know. I want to know. And go see these guys. Where are you going to be at? Uh, oh, I'll be in, uh, I'll be in L.A. On the third at the, at the improv. If you, if you're in LA, go see him at the improv. And then I'll be in Tampa the 22nd through 25th. Columbus, Tam the funny uh, bone. Yeah, March thing through thing. Miami the 9th through 10th. Uh, if you go to theandrewschultz.com, you can check out all my dates. All his name. He's, he's everywhere. Yeah. Comedy in Miami. Uh, I heard that club's pretty good. Yeah, I, yeah. They just reach out to me, and I, I'm excited good. to go to Miami. I didn't, you know, they don't have a real club there. But then uh, Stress Factory back here in Jersey, and then I'm going to do the Carlson too in Rochester. There you go. We'll both know how it is. Yeah. Um, what do you got there, Justin? Um, you could a, check a out Trigger. Oh, I got fucking triggered like crazy. I got this podcast. Oh, there it is. I got a podcast <laughs> called Neurotica. It's a sex and anxiety podcast. So if you like hearing me flip out and talk about like why I'm like the way I am, who's the girl? I'm you know, it's Tracy. I'm Carnazzo. in. It's Who? fucking great. Tracy Carnazzo. We talk what, about like- What is she, a comedian? Yeah, she's like a young comedy. She's really great on podcasts. She's, um, she's but we cute. talk about anxiety and nice like- Nice hair. Sex and all that kind of <laughs> shit and my fucking, all our, where our crazy like shit comes from. <laughs> nice and then um, just go to, at I am Justin Silver on social media and I am Justin Silver com. You'll see all my shit up there. Awesome. What do you got? Um, I'll be in La Jolla at the comedy store. Mm -hmm. well, look at that photo. That's a great picture. Good picture. Who took that? Good um, good. it was for some MTV show, I think. Oh, um, and then I'll be in Winnipeg at Rumors February, I think. Am I doing that? Twenty something ish. I think and I then, booked one of those too. And then I'll be in Poughkeepsie March third. I love those guys. How is that? Oh, how cool. is that club? That's great. A newer club, you go right? in. You can if you don't even want. You can just take the train from Grand Central. Right, yeah. Oh, the um, drops you off right. Laugh it up. Laugh literally it up. at the gig. That's oh, a fun. Cool. No, no, but you can't take it back. Why? Because well, no, it closes. It's too late. I picked an it gets out too late. Car, oh, so sorry, we're don't do drive that. Together. Oh, it's great. Okay. I mean, you get murdered in Poughkeepsie if you go too far away from the gig. But where the gig is, <laughs> it's fucking great. Well, that's where Snooky is from. So I'm excited. Poughkeepsie? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She doesn't live there now. No, but I'm excited to go to her hometown. Oh. Um, great, great club. <laughs> You'll love those guys. Good. Um, okay, what do you got? Uh, I'm opening for you tomorrow at Fat Black, you said. and then Am the, I? Yeah. Did I say that? You yeah. said, I like how you said that. You promised. <laughs> then I'll be with uh, promise. at the Improv in uh, San Antonio with Dustin Chafin towards the end of February. Dustin Chafin. All right, cool. Well, Gab, what do you got? I'll be in a bunch of bars and basements. Hey, Follow, yep. Have I'll you gotten any followers you, on your Instagram from yeah. the show? Yeah. Um, she's, a bunch of weirdos her, message me all the time. She's. Got, <laughs> I love it. Keep doing it. Her, her fucking Instagram, she does the story part more than anybody I know. She's always, and she goes always, hey guys. Seven and, people watch it. And I want to, and I'm one of those seven. And it fucking, I, I'm addicted to it. Everyone. I'm addicted to it. I cannot watch it. How old are hey you guys, guys, she's 16 and a half. Perfect. Dude, you're not. I just said she. He said perfect. I can't 16. believe you're... we just started to open up and then it's done. I mean, listen well, to what... erotica. This is all I do. I wanted to hear it's about cognitive come on behavioral therapy. It. Well, I did great. too, mm. but you wouldn't get to it. You kept he, flipping I kept out. getting interrupted. No, you Ooh, kept getting don't triggered. Nah, buddy. Me. Nah, buddy. Tell me real nah, quick. Nah, buddy. Nah, buddy. I would like you, to hear. I got to run. I got to. I got. I got. You want to? I got something very cool happening. What? Um, you know, funny for Fido, the benefit. Of course, I do. It just got picked up by Barkbox, and we're planning a theater tour. So I got to plan a tour of twelve cities. Well, just going. You pay me the right money. I'll fucking. If you pay me the right money, I'll headline. Bark box. Is you're so you're cute. on it all the time, and it's a bit I've not been on it once. You've been on it twice, Bob. Two times. Just checking to see if you knew. You're on it twice, <laughs> and, <laughs> and you're on the actual <laughs> banner. What's the, the tour? We're doing. We're got to. Well, who's gonna be on the tour? Oh, I got to buy hire a tour manager. We got to do twelve well, cities. So are you gonna do? Out. Are you the headliner? No, I host it. So who's gonna headline? We're gonna have. That's what I got to figure out. We're going to have- It needs to be, be a dog lover. Oh, Bobby's great on it. He crushes on it every fucking year. Every show I do, I crush. I'm a crusher. 
Okay. You've anyway. never seen me not crash. I'll talk to you all about my <laughs> never CBD. Never But I gotta I'm run. I gotta. Run, I gotta run over there to have yeah, a fucking meeting know. with them. I murder hoes. I know you murder hoes. Um, <laughs> but I'll talk to you all about cognitive behavior therapy. I'll come back. Uh, Can you just tell me it. what it is, real quick? Yeah, you. You're on Skype. What does he tell you to do? We're, you're changing. I have anger behavior. issues. I know, people who interrupt me fucking aggravate me. So what would you do for that? <laughs> if somebody. What the fuck? Like, 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 stop touching me with your dad think, hands like, right now. He, like, with I your massage? loved dad hands. Does he give you exercises to work Every, on? For everything the week? is everything is basically this. You're like, what are the what are the behaviors that these thoughts and feelings are that are causing you that are standing in the way of you moving forward? And then you're like, okay, let's try to reshape these behaviors and reprogram so you're actually doing things and exercises when these thoughts come up to make you change. What's the one of the that exercises? Um. Uh, what's okay? Here's a fr- so if you have like repetitive negative thoughts about something, and when you have those thoughts, you end up like y- y- you'll isolate or whatever you do. Yeah. It's like, all right, I want you to objectify those thoughts and imagine it's like a radio station that's playing like some sort of negative news radio. And then whenever that happens, yeah. I want you to like, I would have like a clicker on your phone and you click it. Like you just have a counter mm-hmm. and you just and instead of following thought, you're like, oh, here's that thing again. And I count it. And at the end of each week, we see like, is the number going up or going down? So there's everything is just like exercises and behavior modification because the whole thing is. And I know we're working with dogs. Like if you change, if you bring the body, the mind will follow. And it's like you can't do it the other way. What do you say that again? If you, you bring, bring the, the body, body, the mind, mind will follow. follow. You can't think your way out of like, you know, from AA, you can't think your way out of right action. You can only act your way into right thinking. AA is mm-hmm. technically it's a form of CBT. Mm-hmm. You're surrounding yourself with people who don't do these things. You're not showing up with, with people, places, mm-hmm. and things. Mm-hmm. You, that's basically what it is. It's cognitive behavioral training. That's the only fucking shit that works. So think about For it like this person. When you lost weight, right? You hit the gym real hard. <laughs> Right? You hit the gym real hard when you What's lost What's your name weight. again? Uh, my name Justin's is Justin's got to go. <laughs> Justin, I'll see you later, buddy. I love you, buddy. Love you too, pal. You need so to much. take that picture. All right. So gonna, let's take a picture real let's quick. Let's wrap up. Yeah. All right, we're going to wrap up. You guys are the best. Thank, Thank you for coming you. on. Zach, what do you got? Well, I got to run. Zach, the new guy. You guys are the best. Uh, I love you guys. You know what, dude? Do I have to say anything to you? You guys do it all. Yeah. Uh, make sure we got some good stuff happening very soon. So uh, keep tuned to that. And uh, you're the best uh, fans in the world. You know what, dude? I'm- What? That was so goofy. I was, that's, that's what I was do, going for. <laughs> you think this was serious right here? <laughs> hey, guys. Thanks for listening. If you want to come on the show as audience members, email ykwdproducer at riotcast.com. Um, if you want to send fan art, love letters, uh, hate mail, um, pictures of yourself, send it to 117 McDougal Street, um, New York, New York, 10012. And follow us on Twitter and Facebook at YKWD Podcast and on Instagram at YKW Dude Podcast. Uh, make sure you follow us on that one. You go to another one, it's going to be the wrong one. So this is the one to follow. Follow Gabby at Gabby is Brian. And, and follow Mike at Mike B. Suarez. See pictures of my cousin. All right. So thanks a lot, guys. <laughs>